Hey guys, it's your boy Gabe here, back in another video, and guess what we're playing today? We're playing Sanic Mania Plus! That's right! It's a new game, well pretty new, it's been like two days old, but I'm sorry I couldn't get it out when it first came out, I had stuff to do and all that stuff, but anyways, anyways, um, we're gonna be doing some Sonic Mania Encore mode today, which is the new mode they added. I think it spices up the levels and makes them a thousand times harder. So, uh, yeah, let's try this out. Now, I've actually played through a little bit of this. Um, the farthest I could go was Chemical Plant because, unfortunately, I actually did record this, but it was just trash, and I just wanted to redo it. But anyways, I'm going to try to act like I've never seen this before, like Angel Island and uh, Green Hill Zone. So I'm going to try my best acting skills. All right, so Angel Island Zone. All right, this is a fresh start. Uh, it makes me very excited because I, li I like this. I like this a lot. Anybody wish we could get Sonic 3 Remastered? Because I know people have been asking for that for years and years and years, but say you can't make it. I was thinking, well, if you don't know the story by yet, your boy Mike actually did uh, music for it. And when he died, they can't get the uh, license to it. So, uh, basically, Sega's forced not only they can't make Sonic 3, but because of the music. That's literally it. And they did that thing, like, on the PC where they changed the music. I guess they could do that, but... The chances of that are very rare. But anyways. Alright, so we got through Act 1. That was the easiest thing ever. It was so short. But anyways. Alright, so now it's a really difficult part. Because you got to pick between your boy Mighty and your boy Ray. Now, I'm just looking at Ray. He looks so adorable. I mean, just look at that face. Doesn't he just look pretty? I'm psyched. That's the wrong number, Mighty. I'm sorry, Ray. Boy, I made it look like I was going to pick Ray and just ran over to Mighty. I don't like Ray's controls. That's the only reason why I didn't pick him. Mighty actually can dodge spikes and stuff. So, yeah, that's the only reason why I picked him. Also, not only can he do that, he go boom. He can do that. And then look, he can just bounce off a spike like that. Look at that. He doesn't even do damage to a spike. So, he can just jump on a spike. He's fine. He can get impelled by a spike and go, what, what is this? And looks like we're going to have to go through Mania all over again. Because if you look at this, you'll see the hard-boiled heavies. They're coming back to life to kill us. Well, isn't that wonderful? Alright, let's get into this. Okay, I'm so excited to play through this. Because, you know, I, I, I don't know. I mean, Sonic Mania was fun from the beginning. I mean, just revived all those classic memories of playing Sonic 1, 2, 3, 4, and whatever games I had on my Wii because if you don't know, I actually played Sonic games on the Wii. <laughs> yeah. Let me tell you, back in those days, it was the good old days. Now I don't know why I actually like Sonic. Like I'm not. I mean, I mean that sounded so weird. But anyways, like I just remember that. Like that was the only game I played that was actually pixelated for the time. Every other game, well, it was HD. And by HD, I mean like 240p. Now if you don't know what 240p is, it's uh, really low quality. But back in the day, that was good stuff. Because, you know, the Wii days, I wish those could come back. I like that. Like, a lot. But anyway, so here you got your boy Sonic and your boy Tails back. And uh, basically, now you can actually do this thing called a switch. Which is basically like uh, when Knuckles Chaos, you can just switch between characters. And you just press triangle, boom, switch. That's all you gotta do. So it's pretty new. It's a new feature that they haven't brought back for like how long? Mm, 22 years, I want to say. I think it was 22 years. I, I don't know. My math may be off, but from what I can remember, I think that's right. Whoa, gosh! Whoa, hello there. Hello there, friend. Oh, God! Oh, my gosh. Okay, that was. Okay. That just gave me a mini heart attack. I'm not going to lie. Alright, so yeah, I'm just playing some Sanic, you know. Now, how do you actually switch between characters? I know there's like a switch box right there, but, uh, was there- Wait, 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 wait a second, I think there was a special stage ring in there. Let me switch to my boy Tails here. Wait, no, it's just invincibility. Okay, so I think there are special stage rings in these stages, but it's kind of rare to find them. From what I know. I don't know. I don't even know. Why did I even say that? I don't even know. I'm basically lying to you guys. I don't even know what I'm saying. I mean, it could be rare. It could not be rare. I don't know. But anyways. Oh, did Tails just glitch the floor right there? I don't know. Oh, yes. You got Danger on the dance floor playing right there. It's a pretty cool boss theme. Boom. Oh, wait. I missed. I missed. There we go. Okay, ready? Yeah, boom! 
Oh, Tells, you're supposed to knock it back to me again. Yeah, who cares? What? He's showing his muscles. You see that? He's like, <laughs> boy, Mighty. Mighty likes to show the muscles. He's like, <laughs> I gotta say, Mighty, you're pretty muscular. <laughs> Well, he's pretty muscular for an armadillo. I mean, I've never seen an armadillo look like that. If I saw an armadillo look like that, I'd probably lose my mind. I go, what's this rule of life? <laughs> Alright, uh, switch a Maru. I don't want to switch a Maru, Mighty. Oh, wait, never mind. Okay. Alright, you get your boy, Mighty. <gasps> oh, I thought that was going to transform into Ray. I was going to say, if it transformed me into Ray, I was going to be mad. Alright, so I guess we're on a mission to rescue Ray. Okay, that's an interesting mission. And okay, special stage ring. What did nothing? Okay. Well, when you walk on spikes, you got to use mighty because what? He does damage now. Okay, for one second he doesn't do damage, and another second he does. Oh, wait, do you have to jump on the spikes? I wonder if it's jump on the spikes. I bet it's jump on the spikes. My bad. All right, so we're just gonna go down here with mighty and your boy Sonic. You know, always your boy. You've been your boy for thousands of years now. Mighty, I don't know about him. Do people even know who Mighty is anymore? I don't think they do. What am I? I don't know. I think Mighty's more popular than Ray because all my friends know who Mighty is. Well, most of them are like Sonic. None of them know who Ray is. I'm like, you guys know Ray? And I'm like, what in the world is a Ray? <laughs> so, yeah, I guess Mighty is more popular than Ray, which is kind of depression, though, because when you think about it, they were both, uh, you know, they were supposed to be the Sonic family. Well, not like that, but you, you get me, right? Like the trio. Um, you know the Sonic Tells Knuckles, right? Well, back, back, way back when, somewhere, I don't even know, they were supposed to be Sonic, Ray, and Mighty. They were supposed to be the same, but then Sega was like, no, I don't like that. I don't like a muscular armadillo. Let's let's get uh, a, a echidna and a, t and a fox in here. And then they were like, okay, okay. <laughs> so yeah, that's how Knuckles and Tails were born and Mighty and Ray were born. But anyways, okay, pinball time. Okay, how do you get... How do you- Oh my gosh, okay, this- these controls are a little bit off. Why does that sound so sound familiar? Alright, please give me something good. Do not give me that Eggman bomb thing. Hey, we got a ring! Nice. Is this good for kids to be trying to gamble for rings? I don't think so. I, I don't even know how to explain that, but... Anyways. Oh, I'm not hitting the switch box, no. I'm good. I'm good. We got. I got my two favorite guys, Knuckles and Sonic. Now, you could argue that Tails is a little bit better than Knuckles. I mean, he's probably got the, a better brain than Knuckles, but Knuckles is... Well, let's just say, you know, actually, yeah, I got it right, because if you saw Mighty over there, he was showing his muscles. Knuckles has muscles. They both have muscles. Then he got, I don't know, Sonic's just there. He's just like, hi, my name's Sonic. <laughs> now, we're actually going to have to use Sonic for this boss fight, because Knuckles' jump is messed up. It's I don't know what, but it's just really bad. And, you know, usually by this time, I'd already have Super Sonic. Wait, could you even get Super Sonic this early? I don't think you could. But anyways... Like, I remember how to take on this guy. It was pretty simple. You have to just, like, jump up the hill. You jump any other time, you're gonna get wrecked, but it's fine. It's Sonic. Ow! Gosh! That bomb just surprised me. Okay. Well, we already lost the rings. I might as well just lose them all again. <laughs> oh, well. Alright, we actually better hurry this job, because you don't actually, if you actually don't finish the job, you actually die. Whoa! Thanks for taking the hit, Knuckles. Whoa! Okay! All right. That was the smartest thing ever done. Hey, that's how you beat him. That's how you beat him like a boss. You just gotta, you just gotta take like five hits to get him. Um, it all started with the one little ring loss that caused me to just do that. And yes, you can do that on all the boss fights. You can just do that. <laughs> it's kind of, I don't know. It's kind of a nub move, but you know. I did it back, way back in the Sonic days, like Sonic 1, Sonic 2, Sonic 3, I did that. <laughs> I didn't feel bad at all. I mean, the game doesn't punish you for doing it, so why not do it? Alright, so now it's time for that thing to happen where you feel like, whoa, okay, alright. That's what happens. You, you just feel, you just feel weird when that happens. And I'm not the only one who has eyes hurt after that, right? Whoa! 
Okay, no joke. I forgot what Chemical Plant Zone looked like. It looks so good. Like, look at this. Like, look at the background. It's so it's so cool. Chemical Night Zone. Is that you? Oh wow! Look at Sonic's run. Wait, was that always in the game? I don't remember that. Was it? I don't remember. It kind of looks like a Sonic 2 run, like they were supposed to originally make that, like the uh, way Sonic was running. They were supposed to make that that way in Sonic 2, but they just got rid of it for some reason. Ow, gosh! Anybody else hate those blue things that come out of the tube, those little ball chain things? Yeah, I hate those too. <laughs> Why didn't I get that shield up there? Actually, wait, let's switch back to our boy Knuckles and get that uh, water shield. Okay, wait, I can't even... Can you even get up there? No, you can't even get up there. Okay, well, I'm gonna do go around the loop de loop jump. Oh wow, you can't even get to Oh gosh, we're gonna die. Oh, they got rid of the scary music. Yo, they got rid of the scary music. Well, I'm gonna die because I didn't get the shield, but who cares? They got rid of the scary music. Way to rub it in. Wait, what? I'm alive? How am I alive? Hello? Okay, this is confusing. Oh, I bet those are lives down there. Oh, okay, I get it. So when Tails or Sonic dies, it moves on to the next. Oh, I get that now. Okay, I was wondering what that was. So your lives are the characters you get, like the characters and the things right there. Okay, that makes sense now. Wait, so does that mean you only get one shot of the level? Oh, gosh, okay. That might be a problem for some people. I'm glad they got rid of the scary music though. We're like, that scared me. Now I'm used to scary. I was like five years old. I don't know if it scares me now. It kind of haunts me, but it doesn't scare me like it used to. Like when I used to hear that music, I used to get scared. I was like, oh gosh. But now I rarely ever hear that music, so yay me. All right, so let's just jump over here. Oh gosh, spikes! Okay, let's use it. Let's use tails here. Okay, come here, tails. I want you to pick up Sonic. Oh, pff, or not? Okay. Whoop! Nope, you're not getting me, boy. Okay. All right. Oh gosh. Okay, you definitely use tails for this part. Come on! 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 Yes, I did it. Okay, I was lucky. I just realized something. Tails is so breakable. Oh, gosh! I did not suspect that up there. Okay, yeah, these levels are getting a little harder. Because uh, that thing just came out of nowhere. I was just having a good time. Then, pfft. Wait a second. I thought we were in Chemical Plant Zone Act 1, weren't we? Then why is the boss appearing? Because this was at the end of Chemical Plant Zone 2, I remember. Wait a second, are we combining levels here? Wait a second. Or is it a false alarm? Is it a false alarm? I don't know. Are we combining levels here? Then again, I don't really remember how the Sonic Mania thing worked. I thought I remembered it as they were the same, and then when you got to the second one, that's when they put the new stuff in. At least that's when I remember. I don't remember that, though. Because it's, like I said, it's been, like, through, did I say last time I played Sonic, it's been through March or April? Did I say that last time I did? I don't think I did. But anyways. Oh, it's not. Okay. I guess it was normal then. I thought it was. But then again, I haven't played this game forever, so. You can't really blame me for not knowing anything about it now. Now the only thing I know is Fortnite, and you're probably thinking, oh my gosh, why do you have to bring up that game, Gabe? We don't like that game. Oh, uh, I don't know what you're going to do when I'm doing up for, up uh, Fortnite upload. I don't know what you're going to do then. You guys go, Ow! Then again, I just like sticking to the classics like Sonic and Mario, and oh gosh! Hit him, Tails. Hit him. Hit him. Thank you, Tails. Thank you. You're a true friend. Thank you. Thank you. I will buy a Tails doll now. You know what I'll do with that Tails doll? I'll put it up on my wall and I'll, like and I'll get like a little you know like those little box things like get like a box thing like put a little uh, note at the bottom. Yeah, I'll get one of those and I'll put it at the bottom. This is a Tails doll to remember Tails doing his ultimate sacrifice to me in Chemical Plant Design. That would actually be a good doll. I kind of want to do that now. 
Anyways. Alright, so now we're in typical plant zone. It'll probably be the last stage we do for this part of the game. And uh, it's looking pretty good. It's got that nighttime g going on like the first one did. Now, I like to call this one Jell- Oh, gosh! I was gonna say I like to call it Jello, but I guess I could also try to call it Pain. Because that's what it is. It's a lot of pain. Well, at least on Encore Mode. Encore Mode makes everything harder than what the original did. Are there special stages in this? Because I have not seen any if there are. No! Not Sonic! Why? I kind of just want to kill Tails on purpose now. I mean, I'm not saying anything to people actually like Tails as a Sonic character, but I just don't like him that much. I know plenty of people who do. <laughs> But I just don't really care for him. I mean, he's okay, but I'd rather my, I'd rather Sonic or Mighty or I'd even prefer Ray over Tails. I'm just kidding. That is that is the biggest lie I think I've ever told in my life. <laughs> Tails will always be my third favorite. Well, actually, fourth favorite if you count Mighty in there. But <laughs> yeah, I mean, Tails is pretty cool. He's, he can fly, so that's something. Sonic can't fly, so. I mean, I guess he's got some going for him. Okay, now how do you hit those? Oh, wow, you can't even hit them with tails. Well, I bet you can hit them with... Wow, wait a second, special stage ring right there. Huh. Okay, so I guess there are special stages. Hmm. I kind of want to do them, but if I get supersonic, then it would take away from the... Because this is game mode. It's supposed to be like hard mode for the original, isn't it? I think it is. So if I got supersonic, the challenge would go away, and I kind of want to suffer. <laughs> that sounds messed up, but I kind of want to do it. I want to have a raging moment! Bro, I had 100 rings. I had 101 rings, bro. 101 rings. And you, that, that's the way you treat me. That's the way Sega treats you when you get when they say, "Oh, oh, he has too many rings. He has too many rings." And they're just like, "Okay, send in some more guys." Cause Sega, well, they're just a big trolls. They're just trolls. They just want to make you rage and watch you laugh. They like to watch you laugh whenever you're tor you're being tortured. They're like, oh. I kind of remember the level design now. It was really messed up around here. I do remember that. I do not want to jump through that. Abort the mission. Abort the mission. Oh, I did. Oh, I did not mean the special stage ring. But hey, I'd rather dunk in the special stage ring and switch tails to somebody than. Well, I don't. Ho I hope it's not Ray. Anybody but Ray. Please, anybody but Ray. Are there any such thing as Ray fans? Like, does anybody like Ray? Like, is their favorite Sonic character? I bet there are some people out there that like that, but... Who, though? I know, guys, if, you're, if Ray is your favorite Sonic character, let me know. Because that's kind of interesting. I never actually knew anybody who actually cared for him. Then again, I didn't really care. <laughs> I was just kind of like, oh, you like Ray? Okay, that's cool. But now, like, Ray, now, I guess you can introduce Mighty and Ray. But it kind of makes you think, are they going to be in any more games? Or just this one? Because we see, last time we seen Mighty was in... I don't know, there's a poster in Sonic Generations. I guess it was Knuckles Kadox then, last time he was actually playable. And, um, Ray, I don't even know. I think, I don't even know what game he was playable in. I think it was, like, an arcade game of Sonic, but... I have never played that game before, and I, th I don't think you can anymore, because it was only in arcades, so, uh, technical difficulties there. Alright, so now we're gonna go down here, and I guess we're playing Mean Bean again. Huh, I never saw Knuckles animations for this. Alright, now, I'm just gonna tell you guys this, my Mean Bean machine skills are, uh, let's just say a little bit rusty. I may make some wrong moves, and I know all you guys, I like, this game is like one of my favorite puzzle games, probably, but... I just haven't played it in forever, so I might be trash at it. And I've seen some good people that are actually good at this game. Like, they're so good. And they make me kind of jealous. I'm like, why can't I be this good? <laughs> but yeah, I mean, I've seen really good people at this game. And they've been like, and I was like, wow, you got good skills. I'm like, oh, thanks, bro. 
Anyways, yep, boom. There we go. Oh, gosh, I'm destroying Eggman right here. Eggman, you are getting destroyed by someone who's not played Mean Bean in, like, forever. That's kind of sad. You're a grown man. That's kind of sad. Okay, oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. There we go. Yes, okay. Boom. Okay, I'm going to put the green one right there. Connect to connect. All right, then you get that red one right there. Oh, my gosh, I am destroying him right now. I don't even think I played this good whenever I did Sonic Mania like on the Gaming Bros. I don't think I was even this good. I guess my skills have improved. I've proved myself worthy. Now, what other worthy foe can I attack? Or something, I don't know. The poor Eggman, I just destroyed him. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> that made him mad. Alright, let's get out of here. So boom and boom there we go all right guys i think it's gonna wrap it up this video um if you guys did enjoy this and you do want to see more make sure to drop a like comment like and subscribe do all that stuff all right till next time guys bye bye but before i actually do go let's, i'm just gonna show you i want to see what studio apples looks like oh my gosh okay all right all right guys i guess i'll see you guys next time in studio apple soon all right peace goodbye Hey guys, welcome back to Gay Plays Sonic Mania Part 2. We are in Studio Opera Zone. I also want to apologize how long this video took to make. It took like 10 days. Anyways, here we are in Studio Opera Zone. Where we're going to be playing with Ray the Flying Squirrel and Knuckles the Echidna. And oh, there we go. Finally did that right. Anyways, if you're going to play with Ray around here, you got it. Now, this is the hard thing about playing with Ray is when you fly, you actually have to let go. Yeah, just let go like that, and then you can actually curl up in a ball and actually attack enemies. It takes some getting used to, but once you've mastered it, you can destroy stuff. And it feels so weird. Like, when you do that, you think you're just going to fall to your death, but no. You would think you could just fly into enemies. I hope they fix that, though, because that is kind of hard to do. And it just feels so awkward to do it. But but anyway, anyways. Um, so yeah, here's Studio Opus now, a stage where you go through a Hollywood kind of stage and, you know, just interact with objects and stuff. There's a lot of references, too, around here. Um, I think we passed through a little of, uh, what's it called, um, yeah, forget it, but we did pass through one where, uh, it says that Christian Whitehead, um, Head Cannon and Pagoda West Games are making a game or something, and look, there's an Eggman Director's Chair, look at that, <laughs> and you got, like, several, uh, signs in the background, it has ages, which is Sega backwards, a lot of references around here. And, you know, I think it's a really nice touch they added all these in here, because, uh, well, you might not get the reference, but you can at least have a little laugh about it. Like, look at the back, there's Eggnog, it has a picture of, uh, Eggman. Maybe a Sega Sonic Popcorn Shop, that's actually a Japanese game, where you guys can make popcorn and turn a crank to make Sonic run, yeah. And look, there's like a little, kind of like Mickey Mouse-style Eggman up there, I can see that. And, uh, sorry if I sound tired in this video, guys. It came out, like, at 1, so apologize for that. Anyways, if you guys see up there, there's, like, a little film thing up there. It tells you what, what the movie's about. There's, like, a Game Gear thing on the TV. And, oh my gosh, I sound like one of those people who have not been stopping Game Facts. And, yes, I actually did get this a lot. A lot of these from, like, people who actually do do a lot of references. There's the little thingy. You know, where they're gonna take a little clip of the movie, just go... And then, you know... Other things... So anyways, this stage is probably one of my favorites in Mania. It's just so much fun to play through. And it has good music. It has good everything. It has a lot of good references. And I was surprised they didn't put Do You Know The Way in here. But, <laughs> okay. I'm actually kind of glad they didn't, though. Because that means kind of dead. And, we you know, if we talk about it still, then uh, I think it's kind of cringe. So, that's probably a good thing they took it out. Well, they never did put it in. But I think they shouldn't have. Because, would have, well, there's times when a meme can die. Except Gabe the dog. Gabe the dog will forever be on YouTube. I don't think they'll ever stop making videos of him. But anyways, here we are with Ray the Flying Squirrel and Knuckles Do You Know The Way. Okay, I'm going to stop saying that. Now, this is the hard part of this. But it's not even hard. It just feels so awkward to do so. You just need to roll into this missile instead of just, like, jump on it. I always thought you had to jump on it. But no, you had to roll on it. Like, I would have never thought of that. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But yeah, this stage is just so good. Like, I know I've said that, like, at least 5,000 times. But this stage is so good. And, yeah, it's just so good. And is that, I always thought that he was holding a mirror right there, the egg right there. But turns out, I think he's holding, I think that's a bat, actually. 
or like a club he's gonna beat you with but no it, I always thought it was a mirror he was like that one just looking at himself while the boss fight was going on but no it's actually a club he wants to kill you you know I'm still getting kind of used to race controls because I haven't really mastered them and they take a lot of getting used to if you want to you know no life ray but you know just let go at the last second that's all I can really tell you mm. Then you got Knuckles, which I haven't been this entire time. And uh, I actually looked up on YouTube what Encore mode meant, and it actually was nothing like I even said in the first video. So in the first video, I thought it was going to make the mode harder, which it does feel like it is a little bit. And I thought it was going to also like do some weird thing where like boss fights got um, a little bit harder. But yeah, it does do all that stuff. But the thing it um, Encore mode is really about is the new life mechanic, where you can, like, after your lives are characters. That's the main thing. So I'm trying to think of another one. So your lives are characters, and then... Let's see. There was one more. Oh, yeah, and the point of it, like, the new thing, it's basically Mania 2 like this, but... You know, we all know what Mania 2 is going to be like. It's going to be amazing, and this is kind of like Mania Part 2. Kind of, you have to go through all the stages again, so yeah, it's kind of Part 2. And then Knuckles just smiling, and he's like, yeah, you did it, buddy, you did it. Well, thank you, Knuckles, you gave me some determination. Determination is what makes you feel good when okay that moment you realize like a video game character made you feel like you could do anything <laughs> Kind of made me depressed. Okay, let's not talk about that. Anyways, here we are in Studio Opposone Act 2 Probably the coolest one. I don't know. It's better than the first one music wise. It's not but stage it is Okay, yes, let's switch can we switch mighty please I mean not mighty Ray sorry Yes, Sonic! Yes, even better. Hey, it's Sonic! Sonic! Sorry, I had the worst voice cracked there when I was trying to do that voice. Sonic, he can move! Sonic, he's got an attitude! Okay, I'm gonna stop. Anyways, here we got like a little thing right there where you can go through all these things and make a lot of stuff go happen. And yeah, it's gonna happen, alright. Alright, five. Okay, here comes the multiplication. Five times two times three times one equals... Um, I don't know, sixteen? <laughs> 16. I think they add them instead of multiplying. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that's kind of broken. Alright, go over here. Bounce through here. Go through the loop de loop right there. Perfect. Zoop. Go through there. Gotta go through those satellite plugins. Okay, look out for that. Um, there's a bonus thing, which we're not gonna go into because that's just a pinball thing. Whoa! Okay, that, that was kind of cool. I gotta say, that was that was pretty cool. Oh gosh, whoa, okay. We got bees, we got the bees knees up in here. Okay. There's another movie, oh my gosh, I did not mean to jump into this. Well, I guess might as well play some pinball. I mean, I like it, it's pretty cool. Do, 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 do. Oh look, there's Mighty, okay, let's try to get Mighty. Oh, he missed him. Okay, let's try to get him again. Come on. Come on, Mighty. Oh, we almost got the bomb. Okay, that was close. So, yeah, like I said at the beginning of the video, sorry it took forever to make this. Like, I don't know what it was, but I looked at the original date, which was like July 19th. It is July 29th. I, it took like 10 days to make this. Really apologize for that. I meant to get it out like July 25th, but there was so much stuff. Like, I would do this, but then like stuff would happen around like I it wouldn't record, and there was times where I didn't really feel like recording because I was tired and because I stayed up half the night. And then there were days where I wanted to do it, but I didn't, didn't get the chance to because I had other stuff to do. So yeah, finally, it's finally out though. I mean, it took forever and. I don't know it, it just I'm really glad it got to come out and I'm really ex excited to do this let's play and then I don't know what we're gonna do after I'm done with this let's play like I already posted plans on Google Plus if you want to check them out go go by using the links um, up above and like the channel art section but like there's a lot of stuff that I wanted to do like there's a Sonic Mania thing I did I'm doing that right now then there's a Sonic Adventure thing I want to do Sonic Adventure 2 1 and 2 and then I want to do Generations and maybe a Sonic Forces live stream. I don't know. But it's weird though. I don't think I'll be able to do that because if you look at Sonic Forces, you actually can't turn the music down. So the music will probably be louder than my voice. I just realized that. I probably can't do that then. It'll probably just have to be like a little short video then. 
But anyways, those are just future plans. I Like I said, they're in Google+. Plus. If you want to go check that out, you know. Leak is in the channel art. Go check it out. Or you could just go to the About page if you don't want to click on channel art. But anyways, enough self-promotion. Let's go. Get, let's get back to Sonic Mania. So anyways, here we are in Studio Office Zone Act 2, almost to the end of this. And let's just say the second one is a little bit interesting, because it puts in Spring Yard Zone in here. And that's a stage that... I mean, I like that stage. The music's good, but it's kind of bumpy. You, you get it bumped. Okay, that's that was the terrible joke. Bumpy. Really bumpy. It's going to be a little bumpy. Also, I want to give you guys a big shout out because the original video of this got like. Let's see how many likes did it get? I think it got like. Oh, I think it got four likes and it got um, 60 views. That's pretty good. My videos usually don't score that high. You know, we have a small community going on here, so getting that much views. And it, yeah, we've actually got to where we actually get 60 views per video now. It's getting crazy on in gay plays. We can keep the community going up. We can get like 100 views if we keep it up like this. That'd be good. Oh, what, I'm Knuckles? I thought I was Sonic. Oh, that messed me up. When did I switch to Knuckles? I don't, I don't remember that. I honestly don't remember that. Hello? Oh, you have to grab onto the bars. Okay. Also, the last reference they made was um Sonic Party thing. They had, like, the anniversary party for Sonic on July 22nd, 2016. Yeah, that's actually the error thing that played during the live stream. It was like, brrrr, error, error. <laughs> the best part of that, though, was when that guy handed the mic to that guy when he's singing Sonic Heroes. He's like, here you go, buddy, sing. He's like, he's like watch, watch, we're here. And he just handed him the mic. He's like, Sonic Heroes! <laughs> That was so good. I like that so much. Okay, quick edit right there. Sorry about that. Anyways, we're going to be going on to Golden Battery Zone, Act 1 here. And uh, let's just say things get a little um, different around here. Because, yes, I know its name's Flying Battery. Don't correct me in the comments. I did that for a jump. What are you... Oh my gosh, what is this? Okay, quick edit right there. Sorry about that. Anyways, here we are in Flying Battery Zone, or as I like to call it, Golden Battery Zone. And let's just say this is one of my least favorite stages in a Sonic game ever. Especially a Mania. This stage will mess you up so hard if you're not careful. You know, this stage is going to probably take a lot of concentration, so I'm probably not going to talk as much as it I did in Studiopolis. I'd honestly say this is probably the hardest stage in the whole run. Because it's just, I don't know, it's very troll-like. It's very troll level. But wait, 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 okay. Is it too late to switch back to Sonic? Because I just realized something. You actually want to get that fire shield right there. If you get that, you're going to go through the stage a lot easier. And I also think it's um, easier to use Knuckles during this than Sonic. I'm sorry, Sonic. Usually I would use you, but no. Knuckles has got your back. Because Knuckles, he knows the way. Anyways... So yeah, if you do use this, the only thing you can get hit by are those little blue things that slide around on the ground. But honestly, nobody really gets hit by those unless they just pop out of nowhere. <laughs> but yeah, there is this stage and, you know, Knuckles makes it really breakable because you can just fly over the whole thing. So yeah, there's that. Oh, 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 I thought I was about to die right there. Okay, alright. Okay. Okay. And you know, Knuckles does kind of break it, because you look at this, you can just fly up here, like usually with Sonic you couldn't do that, but if you just fly over there with Knuckles, you can skip that part right there, which is kind of hard to do. Then you can go right here, up here, bounce up here, go around this little, little loop-de-loop -loop right here, slide on this thing right here, um, don't get that shield right there, don't, don't do that, it's not worth it. It just makes you stick on those things like you're a spider knuckles or whatever that is. <laughs> just call it a spider knuckles. Yes, it's my new character I've invented. My new OC, Spider Knuckles. He's Spider-Man, but he's Knuckles. You know, they could totally make money using that character. Call me when you want that, Sega. <laughs> Okay, now here's the tricky part. There is this part right here where these things come out of the wall, which we just got through really easy. Then there's also this part right here, which is not that hard. And I remember when I first did this, I actually did- Oh my gosh, did I really just get Ray? Why? <laughs> no, wait, oh, where's Knuckles? Where's Knuckles? Okay, Knuckles, thank you. I did not want Ray out of all the characters, really. Out of five characters, you gotta give me Knuckles. I mean, not Knuckles, Ray, sorry. A jump, jump, okay, okay, I almost died right there. Well, I didn't die, but I got almost got hit. Oh, we'll switch him, Maru. Oh, wait, where's Ray? Where's Ray? I want to switch him. 
Yes, yeah, Sonic! Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna switch back to Knuckles now. Once we get up here. Okay. Oh yeah, and Ray fans, it's not that I hating on your boy Ray, but I just don't really want to do it right here, because this stage is very tricky, and if I get hit once, then I don't think I'll be able to come back from it. It'll be a rough little thing for me to do, and you know, I won't be able to pull it off again, so there is a chance of that, and I don't want that to happen. Oh wait, I just remember, what about Flying Battery Act 2? Oh boy. Wow, I just remember that off that stage. It was basically just raining an egg spider in it. I did not like that. Well, I had Super Sonic when I originally played it, but this? Okay, I don't know if I like this or not. Oh, look, there's the designs for the egg spider. Of course, they're right there on the wall, of course. This stage, I don't really think this is hard, but, I mean, you can get hit by these things. He just makes these little... I don't know, this kind of makes me depressed, because look at that robot, it looks so depressed. He's like, uh, why do I live? You also can see some broken down robot parts in there. You also see that unused bunny thing for that was supposed to be in Sonic 1. Yeah, you can also see him in there. Oh, he probably should be Sonic in this, because I think we're going to get crushed if we're Knuckles. Oh no, there went our shield, oh no. Oh no, as Knuckles would say, oh no. No, 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 come on. Oh, I got hit because it turned on the shock thing. Eh, who cares? We got him, though. We also can abuse this sign now because look how short. Look, it can't even go anywhere. We could just keep spamming it like this. This could be the whole gaming video if I would just do this. But I'm actually not going to do that because I actually want to get through this gaming video. <laughs> okay, so there you go. There's a little history for you. And you can see a bunch of broken down robot parts. Including some weird purple thing at the bottom. I don't know what that is or what it's supposed to be, but something... But anyways, Eggman's a nice guy, so he saved us right there. I don't think he intended to, but oh wow, look, it's silver batter battery now. <laughs> so you're telling me we got a gold battery and a silver battery? Whoa, okay, Sega just got rich. <laughs> I mean, you upgraded me from a standard battery to a gold battery, and now a silver battery. Oh, of course, it could be platinum battery. That actually wouldn't explain a lot. Then we had Platinum batter, Battery, which I assume is like the hardest thing to go through, but I would assume there's a lot of rings in that thing. <laughs> that could be a loot box, and <laughs> Sonic Mania was like a game where you like shoot people. It's like loot box, Platinum Battery. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Was there a Switch box there? Because I kind of, wait, I don't want to switch Knuckles. I want it to be Sonic and Knuckles because that's a game this was from. Oh, look, a Golden Chicken. Okay, that's something you don't see every day. <laughs> In fact, I don't want to see one of those in, in day. So if I remember correctly, I think it took me six minutes to beat this as Super Sonic. So does that mean in the Encore mode, it's going to take me like ten minutes to beat? Oh my gosh, this is, going to be, this is not going to be a good day for me. You know who I wish we could have switched to? was Tails. Tails would have been so useful in this day. Oh, wait a second. Yes! Yes, we got Tails. Tails is going to be so breakable in this. Look at how breakable Tails is. You can just... Is that a special stage ring? We could go through a special stage ring. Okay, let's try it. These are like the hardest things ever. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. They're like so hard to do, but we're gonna try. Okay, guys, please do not make fun of me for messing up so hard in these. Like, it's just really messed up, okay? You know, the easy, like the beginning ones were like so easy, but these are really, they just, I don't know where to start with them. They're just kind of ragey. This is basically Sonic R mixed with, wait, let's see, what's a hard Sonic game? I guess Adventure 2 if you don't know the level design that much. So yeah, let's say an, uh, a, beginning, a beginner who just got Sonic Adventure 2, and he just got Sonic Adventure 2 mixed with the Sonic 3 special stages, um, the Spears, mixed with Sonic R. Um, yeah, that's this stage. So anyways, we're just gonna go through this thing and you'll know, hit these little spears. Look out for those little mine things. I don't know. There's from Sonic 2. I remember that. I, I remember a lot of suffering from playing Sonic 2 because Tails would always get in your way and make you mess up so hard because him and his little Tellsy brain would get in the way of your awesomeness. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Tells fans. I'm sorry. <laughs> but Tells really did mess you up. You can't lie. <laughs> Well, actually, you could lie, because you could just say, Oh, no, Tails never messed me up, because I was Tails. Was anybody ever mad whenever they realized you can't fly as Tails in Sonic 2? Because that made me mad. I was like, what? <laughs> like, that kind of made me hate on Tails. I was like, this thing is trash. <laughs> 
But you know, Tails is one of my favorite Sonic characters, right after Knuckles and Shadow and Big the Cat. <laughs> yeah, but you didn't know I, he was my favorite. You know, you know who my favorite Sonic character? My favorite Sonic character in the entire series is Big the Cat. You can't, you can't, you can't say you don't want Big the Cat, cause let's just say Big the Cat's got your back. He'll help you out. He'll, he wants you to find his Froggy. He's like, Froggy, where are you? <laughs> Uh, did anybody actually enjoy Big Story in Sonic Adventure? Like, I kinda did, but the fishing controls were kinda trash, I'm not gonna lie. And it's not that I hated Big, because Big was amazing, it's just the fishing controls, they, they're bad. <laughs> and oh my gosh, we're about to lose this, because I do not know anything around here. Like, at all. Oh wait, we are catching up though. Can we pull it off? Can we pull it off? Wait. No! Gosh, I fell off the thing. Well, there went tells in the lava. Oh, well. May he rest in peace where he will find peace. Hey, I'll get some practice on those and I'll get all seven Chaos Emeralds. Don't you worry. I gotta say, though, whoever made those special stages weren't playing around. <laughs> Gosh. Okay, now we're back to... Flying battery, platinum battery, okay. Tells, please don't kill me. Please tells, please. Please tells, please tells, please. Please tells. Oh wait, now we're back to gold battery, okay. Please don't kill me, please don't kill me. Please, 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 please don't kill me. Don't cause me to die, Tells, please. Because if you, if, if I get hit once as you Tells, I'm switching to Sonic, okay? I knew in the first one I was like, oh yeah, I'll get a Tells on, and I'll just like, I'll just say how great it is and put it in like in a like a box and like put the title under it like thanks for saving me and stuff. But tails, really, really, mate, really, I'm taking that thing off the wall now. <laughs> tails, I'm taking that thing off the wall. Forget you. I'm putting Sonic in it. <laughs> Forget you. <laughs> I'm sorry, tails. Like right as I said that, I was like, I'm gonna take it off the wall, tails. I'm gonna take it off the wall. <laughs> And then Tails just gets hit. I'm like, Tails, really? <laughs> like, why, Tails? Why? Why you gotta do this to me, bro? Okay, there's that. Okay, let's look out for chicken. Oh, gosh! I knew I knew that was gonna happen. As soon as I jumped, I knew that was gonna happen. So, yeah. You know how I said in the first stage how, like, you wanted to not get the electric shield? Well, in this stage, you actually do want to get the electric shield. And if you... Dude, die if you get hit with it, then you probably feel like trash. But Tails is actually only good in the outside parts of the stage, not in the inside parts. On the inside parts, you're better off with Sonic, but in the outside parts, you're better off with Tails. No, nope. oh wait, there's Mining, okay. No, not Ray, no! Well, actually, no, Ray can actually break this game if you know how to use him. Which I actually do know how to use him in Flying Battery. Oh, gosh! Hold. Oh. Moly. <laughs> what is that swinging animation? Like, what? what is that? What is that? He just got going. Th he's going. I would like to see Ray on the monkey bars now. I honestly would. Just to see that. Just to see that. <laughs> that is the funniest animation I think I've ever seen in a Sonic game. Like, ever. Like, people are like, oh, yeah, Tells is, like, so cute in Sonic games. Like, no, have you seen, have you seen Ray climb those bars? <laughs> we gonna say nothing yet. Because Ray, let me tell you, he's, he's a cool guy. I mean, I know I'm, I'm I kind of talk trash about him just because I don't know how to use him. But that's not really his fault. That's my fault. Hey, at least I admit it, though. <laughs> I don't know, just go on, like, go on YouTube and look up, like, Ray Hater or something. I don't know, I'm sure some peop people are ranting about Ray on YouTube. Like, oh, that Ray, I hate him. He's just a reskin of Sonic. And no, he's not a reskin of Sonic. If you've ever heard that, he's not. He uses some sprites as Sonic. He uses the I think the I think he uses the color palette. They swap it out to yellow and put a tail on him with blue shoes. And I think they do the same thing with Mighty too. But yeah, Rayu and Mighty, they were supposed to be with Tails instead of Knuckles and Tails, which I kinda wish they were, but at the same time I don't. Because without Knuckles, what is Sonic? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> But anyways, you got you got little Ray here, who's like a little squirrel, the flying squirrel. Is his name Ray the squirrel, or is it? Oh yeah, it is Ray the flying squirrel. That's right, it is. 
It's actually called Ray the Flying Squirrel. I forgot about that. I thought his name was just Ray the Squirrel. Well, <laughs> I just realized his name was Ray the Flying Squirrel. I, I knew these things. He... Anyways, this part about it, I don't know. This, this just... I don't like this stage at all. And you can get messed up so hard around here. But hey, as long as you've got your... What? Nani? What was that? Did, did anybody see that? Oh yeah, I forgot. I forgot. Mighty cannot get hit by spikes. Forgot about that part. But did anybody see that? I was going up the loop to... Look at that! Look at that! That, this is this level was designed by trolls at Sega. They were like, oh yeah, do you know any way to make this level like impossible? And the level designers were like, um, yeah, we know way. And they're like, okay, put it in there. <laughs> Let's troll the people play. But my gosh, I do not remember it being this hard. So they must have added some difficulty to it. Because I don't remember it being this hard. They got some Dark Souls stuff going on around here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I know what you're supposed to do. I don't think you're supposed... I think you're supposed to... Okay. Oh, you're not supposed to move. Okay, that's what I did wrong. What? Okay, you better... Come on, let me in there. Let me in there. Oh, you can't even fly in there. <gasps> what? Wait, what? They built it where you can't even fly in there. Oh, so you actually have to do go around the loop-de-loop. -loop. Okay, all right. I get you. So, yeah, this level, let's just say, is kind of hard. I'm not gonna lie. I cannot imagine what Titanic Monarch is like this. Like, I cannot imagine. Hey, like, Egg Spider, and it took us, like, six minutes to get... Oh, my gosh. No, not Egg Spider. Anything but this thing. It's not even hard to beat. I just don't like it. It's really, like, it's so easy. Like, look at this. Boom. Get hit. Boom. Get hit. Well, that one, I couldn't hit him, though. Bummer. I gotta say, this music is so good. Like, if you, if you I don't know what it is, but I, I just find it where I can easily like sing along to this stuff. Like, as every like, oh my gosh, stop singing. But really, if once you get the music in your head, you can't get it out. It's kind of catchy, honestly. Get out of the ray, Eggman. Did I say ray? Get out of the ray, Eggman. No, I meant to say get out of the way, not get out of Ray. Sorry. Ow, gosh. No, no, I have zero rings. Oh, thank you, Knuckles. See, you could thank Knuckles for a lot of things like that. <gasps> oh, yeah, I forgot you could get crushed like that. I completely forgot about that. And also, I just realized we're out of lives. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you see that, kids? Whenever you do a Sonic Let's Play, you can make whatever references you want. Oh, yeah, and also, look up, do you know the way? <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. Everybody knows what that is, I think. But, yeah, you can thank Knuckles for a lot of things like this, and... Wh Bruh? Bruh! That transition was so clean. <laughs> like, I'm not even gonna lie. That was wonderful. <laughs> Alright, well, that that actually is from Sonic... I think it's from Sonic 2 on the Game Gear. Like those little um, parachute things. What, uh, gl glider, sorry. Those little glider things. Yeah, where you actually have to like go right and left and all that stuff. Yeah, I actually remember those. They controlled like trash. <laughs> Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to smash that like button and uh, get it. Let's see if we can get to like five likes. I don't know. Get us to something. And until next time, peace. Oh, yeah. Remember, guys, if someone asks you what your favorite meme is, say, do you know, do we? <laughs> okay, bye. Hey, what's up everybody? Gabe here once again back with another video and guess what? Today we're playing Sonic Mania. That's right.
And, uh, oh gosh, that guy was messing me up. But anyways, this stage is pretty much like a Zen Garden type play mixed with a uh, subway or something. But that's pretty much all you need about this zone, and it's pretty cool. Anyways, you got your boy Knuckles and your boy Sonic, you know, back at it with another adventure. And uh, so, if you didn't watch last time, I mean, yeah, last night's episode, basically, I was playing, and then stuff happened. Like, some interesting stuff happened where I was trying to, like, switch through characters and stuff, and then I got raged so hard because I had to switch through tell and Ray and stuff. It was kind of hard and kind of got messed up in Flying Battery, or if you watch the video, as I called it, Golden Battery. And uh, so, yeah, we're going on to the next stage, and hopefully we can get through this without any problems, because, I don't know, I just don't want any problems. G gosh, I can't even get up here. Okay. Oh, gosh. Four O's. Five O's. Five O's in a row. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Come on. Come on, come on, Sonic. Come on, Sonic. There we go. Nice. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay. We got up here. Beautiful. Okay. See, I'm actually going to switch to Knuckles for a second because I kind of want to glide over this part right here and spin dash, which I can't even do because. There we go. Okay, now I can do it. Beautiful. Okay. Whoa. Oh, gosh. Okay. Spin dash. Whee! Going down to the loop-de-loop. -loop. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, that was kind of tricky. It just turned me into Sonic. I mean, no, I was Knuckles, and it turned me into Sonic. So if I was Sonic, it probably would have turned me into Knuckles. Okay, interesting. Okay, bounce, bounce up here. Oh, gosh, bounce, 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 bouncy bounce. Just keep bouncing, just keep bouncing. <laughs> okay, boom. Oh, what? What am I supposed to do? Oh, I'm supposed to go up here. Okay. There we go. Okay. We go over here to loop de loop. Just like the good old days. Jump. That's not even a loop de loop. Why did I even say that? Well, actually, it was, wasn't it? Oh. Actually, it's kind of a loop de loop. Okay. Bounce back. Oh, they're perfect. That was perfect. Okay. Jump over those guys. They're kind of annoying. Those little ink rabbit things. Oh, gosh. Okay. Jump over those. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Bounce. Uh, let me go over here. Anything in here? No. Okay, bounce up here. Hit that little switch right there. You want to come up here. Can I switch to Knuckles? No, I can't switch to Knuckles. But I can get some rings up in here. And let's see, wait, what's that? Oh, Fire Shield. Okay. Remember Fire Shields from Sonic 3 and Knuckles? Yeah, those were the good old days. Okay, now, if you, there's actually a trick to these. If you go right, if you go left and press right left and then right you guys go faster just like in uh what's it called the uh, sky sanctuary that's what it was oh ink ink and fire well not oil and fire sorry <laughs> oh yeah speaking of which um you can actually light oil lotion on fire in case of those who didn't know it's so fun to do that though maybe like put the whole place on fire you know because you know who doesn't want to set the whole place on fire It'd be beautiful that way where it belongs and the fire and flames. <laughs> because Oil Ocean was not one of my favorite stages in Sonic 2. In fact, I'd probably say it's my least favorite. No, 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 no. I just remember Metropolis. I just remembered Metropolis. Oh, gosh. Don't even get me started on that place. C can I just say how glad I am that that's actually not in this game? Because if it was, I'd probably lose my cool, like, really fast. Oh, another special stage ring. Okay, we c I guess we can try this out. Okay. I think I've got the hang of these now. So the point of these are don't let the UFO get too far ahead. That's pretty much what I've gotten from these. And collect those rings, because if you don't, well, you're pretty messed up. Now, unlike the originals, if you did see the last episode, you'll know I tried this with Tails and failed miserably. However, this time I feel like we can actually do it because I've had some practice with this stage. I don't really think we can do it, but I kind of believe I have more faith in myself than what I did. I have hope. Because you know what they say, home is where the heart is. And well, that made no sense. <laughs> I was like, you know what they say, home is where the heart is. Yeah, I'm sure they say that, but that has nothing to do with Sonic. Okay, jump over here. Jump through those loop-de-loops. Get that ring thing right there. That, oh, that could have gave us a boost right there. Okay. Hey, we're catching up, though. I've actually kind of mastered this stage. Okay. Okay, what? Whoop! jump over those. Okay. Jump over those little spears made of spikes or mines or whatever. Oh, those are mines. Never mind. And then you go up here. Okay, I think... Wait, just keep going. Keep going. I feel like I know what I'm doing now. And there's some doves. How, how you doing, dove? 
And just bounce over. Oh, look, some fishies from Sonic 1. Hey, remember them? Yeah, good times. Oh, gosh, yeah, we're actually going to beat this stage this time. Because, look, we're that close to the UFO. Whoa, okay, 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 whoa, gosh. Oh, yeah, I just remembered something. Did anybody remember that glitch you used to do? I don't know if you can still do it or not, but there was, like, a glitch you used to could do where if you jumped up and, like, moved your analog stick back and forth, you could actually get, like, so much speed from that. Does anybody remember that? Because I remember that glitch. I could actually do that, and then they patched it. I'm like, what? But, yeah, you can actually, I think you can, might actually be able to still do it. <gasps> Bruh, I almost thought I was going to die. Yes, we did it. Yes, yes. Gosh. I never thought I'd be that excited for- Wait, if that was spe special stage one, what is special stage seven gonna be? That's gonna be torture. <laughs> I just remembered that. That's gonna be torture. Like, I don't know if anybody would know what that felt like, but it's gonna feel like torture to go through those, okay? Dude. I actually like this boss music so much, though. It's so good. Now, usually I'd be supersonic by now, but, um... We're not really supersonic, so... Technical difficulties. Uh, what do we do? Hello? Oh, okay. Oh, I was scared to hit him. Okay. Knuckles, protect me. Ha, <laughs> you can't hit me, buddy. Sonic, take some hits for me. Finally! Okay, good. I was about to get hit. Come on, Knuckles. Get some hits in there for me. Or not. Okay, come on. Come on, Knuckles. Come on, Knuckles. Use the power of the Knuckles. Oh, gosh. Time for a Knuckles sandwich. Right, Knuckles? Oh, gosh. No, I guess not. I guess not. Abort the mission. Abort the mission. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Oh, gosh. Okay, please, Knuckles. Please, Knuckles. Please. Okay, so it's the Sonic... Spin dash, just spin dash. Oh gosh. Okay, he hit his thing. Okay. Uh, wait, what? <gasps> what? No, no, no. Oh, well, Sonic got hit. Okay, that's fine. Oh gosh. Whoa. Okay. Not gonna lie. Oh yeah, we could just do the old hit, get hit, and just lose all your rings and hit him. We could do that method. <laughs> Works pretty well. Oh gosh. Oh, he hit his thing. Okay. Good. Cause I can get a couple hits. There we go. Nice. Okay. Whoa, okay. Don't hit me, bro. Whoa, oh, glad I hit, glad he hit that thing. Okay, boom, we got him. That was easy. Okay, he just got destroyed and demolished in like 5 minutes and 35 seconds. Okay, that's not that bad. Not that bad now that I think about it. Okay, just gonna move that signpost around and around. Bounce up there. Okay, got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, beautiful. Walk forward and jump. And guess what you can perform if you do that? I don't know what you can perform, but... I remember there's like a moon lock, uh, which you can do wherever. If like, you jump at the forward and then like let go at the last second, you could... Oh, there we go! I did it! Hey, I did it! You can moonwalk. Hey! Mikey would be proud. Okay, so now we here we are in Press Garden Act 2, which is kind of ice cap. Because, um, that's pretty much ice cap. Where you got these little things in these ice cubes, and you gotta break them out. So, that's pretty cool. Also very chill and relaxed, and I actually like this snow theme level, it's actually really cool. And, um, I have a lot of love for snow theme levels. I don't know what it is, but it just feels like Christmas, you know? Like, you just open that fresh, 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 I meant Christmas present, and, like, you could open it and enjoy it on a fresh morning of Christmas, and, uh, hopefully you didn't get a Sonic for Christmas. <laughs> because that would be weird. It just opens up a Christmas box, and you just see Sonic, and they're like, hi, friend! Like, ah! Oh! I feel like Tails would do that more than Sonic. That what? Hello? Oh, okay. I saw that thing now. I, I didn't even see that. I thought I didn't know what hit me. Okay, get get me out of this ice cube. My gosh. Okay, please just get me out of these ice cube blocks. Gosh. Okay. Hello? Okay, there we go. All right, spin dash, ya boom. All right. Ooh, you got a little will here. Oh, pff, rest in peace, Knuckles. You had a good run. You had a good run, buddy. I'll never forget you though. Okay, I'm gonna jump over here. Get on this thing right here. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, bounce down on these little things right here. Boom, boom, boom. What a wonderful thing. I don't even know. Okay, let me adjust my mic like that. There. there we go. Okay. It's kind of lowered down a little bit. Okay, we're fine now. Okay. Spin dash over these little things right there. Okay, boom, switch a maru. 
Wait, what who we get? Oh, I guess we got Sonic with Sonic. Okay. I don't think that does anything. Do, 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 do. What? Oh, that's a bird? See, these guys got camouflage going on here because I can't see nothing. Like, you gotta look closely on this level. I forgot about that. Okay, whoa, okay. Watch out, Eggman. I don't want to touch that one. Oh, wait, I remember how you do this. There's actually, like, an ice cube at the very end of this thing. You gotta touch, and then it, like, freezes you, and then you can get through the whole thing. Like, right there, you would hit it, and it slam into all that stuff. Okay, I remember. I think I remember what you're supposed to do. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Knuckles. You gotta climb. Oh, gosh. Okay, you gotta climb to the very top of it. There we go. Okay, now you go through the ice cube part, and pff, look at that little animation. <laughs> it's like, like Knuckles is looking around. He's like, what is going on? Hello? Send help. <laughs> okay, that's kind of cool. You're not gonna lie. Okay, you're just gonna break open these little things. Yee! Go through the loop-de-loop -loop a little bit. All right, go to the top. Whoa, okay. I'm not gonna lie. That was pretty cool. Okay, jump up here. Look up for these log things because they get shredded. <laughs> ah, gosh. Those little woodpecker things. My gosh. Okay, well, oh, gosh. Okay, what's this? Okay, beautiful. Okay, well, now, let's see what's over here. Thing over there? Nope, no, it's another there. Oh, gosh, this is a spike trap. Okay, what do I want? I want a mighty. Time it just right. Yes, I got mighty. A. Okay, what? Oh, I didn't mean to be frozen, but okay, whatever. Oh, gosh, look at Shinobi. You know, remember that Genesis game? I played it once. It was on a. I played it on a computer once. It's good, I guess. I actually also played it on my phone. It's pretty good. <laughs> I don't like it as like good as I do Sonic, but it's pretty good. But that's pretty much all this guy is. He's just a Shinobi robot. Oh gosh. Okay, just to stop. Oh great. There's Metropolis. Just another thing to make me remember Metropolis. All the good old days. I'm, those are not good old days, by the way. They were torture. And I don't even know who would call them good old days. They were they were nothing but torture. No one wants to no remember those days. They were not good. They made you... They, it was not good, okay? It, it, it just... I don't really want to talk about it right now. It wasn't good. Okay, here we got a little cutscene that plays when we're going to Metal Sonic stage. That's right. Probably one of the best stages in the game. I don't know why, but it's just really cool. Oh my gosh, okay, I'm not gonna lie, but th this music is so good. Like, if I sing along, you know, oh, Marble Garden's in here a little bit. That's pretty cool. Oh yeah, I forgot about those little lightning bug things. My gosh, so annoying. So yeah, this is pretty much Marble's Speedway. Because as you can see, Marble Zone's here. Oh gosh, look out for those things, yep. I don't remember those from Marble Zone, but I do remember them from something else. I do remember these things from Marble Zone and Sonic 4 Episode 2. Anybody remember that game? That game was actually not that bad. Not as bad as the first one. My gosh, the first one? Whew. Oh yeah, you guys wouldn't recommend me playing that for a Let's Play, would you? Because <laughs> if you did, I probably would not listen to you. I'd be like, no, I'm not doing this. Because Sonic 4, I'm not, I'm not going to be um, like a really, really, really mean about Sonic 4 because I'm... Um, I don't know, like, it, for me, it wasn't that bad of a game. Like, people would be like, oh, it's so bad, wah. But honestly, it wasn't that bad. I mean, Sonic's physics felt like trash in that game, but it, you could still play it, I guess. But at the time, that was, like, one of the first Sonic games I ever played. I didn't know any better, okay? When that game came out, I didn't really care. Let's see, I'm trying to think. It's probably, like, 8 when I played that game, so I didn't really care. Whatever happened, I didn't care what Sonic felt like. I love Sonic and the Black Knight, okay? <laughs> and Sonic and the Secret Rings, okay? They had terrible controls, but I loved them. Now they feel like trash, but back then I loved them. <laughs> but you know the one game I actually really loved was like Sonic Black, Black Knight. People were like, oh, that game's so bad. But honestly, that was one of my all-time favorite Sonic games. Like, honestly. It wasn't even that bad. It was really good for the time. I mean, now it probably wouldn't be that good, but it was good for the time. Sonic Mania is good for the time. I'm telling you that right now. Okay, we jump. Oh gosh, armadillos! Really? Out of all the things you got to put in this thing, you got to put those armadillo things in here. Oh my gosh, I, I remember those things from Spring Yard Zone. They were they were not good. I did not like them. They 
I don't know how to even explain it, but I did not like them, okay? <laughs> Why is this music so good? Like, who, who made this music? I forget his name, but he did a good job. I don't even care who he was, but he did a great job. Like, that's so good. Sonic's always got a good soundtrack. Like, honestly, it, name one Sonic game that didn't have a good soundtrack. I mean, you kind of can't. Well, I don't know, like... Oh, anybody remember that game for the DS called Sonic Chronicles The Dark Brotherhood? Anybody remember that game? Because, um, that game did not have a good soundtrack at all. It literally just remixed it, all like, all the pla past uh, Sonic music, and made it so bad. It was like, Pfft. I was like, ugh, my ears! Like, if you don't believe me, go look up Sonic and the Chronicles The Dark Brotherhood uh, soundtrack. It is not very good. I, I think that's the one Sonic game to have a good soundtrack, but all the other ones, they were great. Plus, nobody even talks about that game anymore. I think I'd be surprised if anybody knew what I was talking about nowadays, talking about that game. Like, I remember when I got that game. I got it at GameStop. I don't remember what year it was, but I got it at GameStop. And the guy was literally like, oh, do you really want this game? You have to do a reading in it. I was like, what? I don't care. I want my Sonic. And yeah, it was actually kind of an educational game, because I don't know, back in those days you were lucky to get an educational game, you know, all those times you're like, oh yeah, you gotta play some educational game. Well, hey, it taught me how to read, so thank you. <laughs> thank you, Sonic Chronicles The Dark Brotherhood. You taught me how to read. Good job. I'm just kidding. Boom. Okay. Oh, go oh, gosh. Okay. I do not remember this boss fight being... Okay. I don't even remember this boss fight, to be honest with you. Like, I'm not even lying. I don't remember it. Like, the last time I actually played Sonic Mania, like, in Mania mode was, like... I want to say that the last time I played it was March. So, I don't really remember this game that much. To me, it's a totally new game. And somebody like, oh, my gosh, why? But, like, literally, I don't, I haven't spotted anything different. Well, actually, yeah, the levels feel a little bit harder, but not much. They kind of feel a little bit off, but not really. And another thing is they just have a really good backgrounds now. They look really beautiful. I love it. Love it. And, uh, yeah, so here we are going on to, oh, the future. I wonder what the future looks like. Yo, that future's gonna be bright, I'm gonna tell you. Oh, gosh! Okay, I forgot about that part. Oh, wow, okay. My eyes, they're burning. Mikkel, is that you? Oh my gosh, did they use, did they use clips from that? Oh my gosh. You can hear him in the background. May he rest in peace. That, that was a good man. <laughs> okay, anyways, here we are in Stardust Speedway Act 2, which probably has the best soundtrack out of all the... Well, not like the whole entire game, but it's probably better than the first one. do 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 And this music is so good, like, honestly, this one's even better than the last one. And that's saying a lot, because the last one I was loving, but this, this is even better. And look at the background, too. It's, like, all green and stuff. That's really cool. You know, the first one we were in Washington, D.C., now we're in, um, Metal D.C. Get it? Because they turned it into robot parts? Okay, <laughs> whatever. Anyways, we're going through the loop-de-loop! -loop. Okay, well, oh, pff, that was a fail. Here we go. Whoa! Okay. Picking up the speed here. Okay, whoa, okay. Is that a new running animation? I don't think it is, because I, I remember seeing that now. Oh, wait, what? I don't remember this. I honestly don't. Reminds me of that, uh, what's it called? It's Sonic Rush, that one stage at the very end where you get on that rocket thing and ride around like that. That's what that reminds me of. I liked Sonic Rush. Like, that was a good game for the DS. That one actually was really good. I think uh, Adventure was better, though, because that one was just so good. Because I like, got in those boats and you got to shoot at those people. That was so fun. Like, I had to go on these adventures to find those uh, mysterious... Um, yeah, I can't not speak. Those uh, mysterious islands out there. And you had to go out there and find them. And there was, like, also that part where you got to race that guy named Johnny. who was always trying to get the chaos symbol before you. That, that game, br that actually brings back a lot of memories. If I actually got a capture card for my DS, I'd actually do a Let's Play of that, but... I don't think I'll be getting any of those one time soon. But if I ever do, I'm, that's the first let's play I'm gonna do. I promise. What? What? This stage was shorter than what I remember. I thought it was used. To, this uh, stage used to be like three minutes. But eh, who cares? There we go. There's the end. Oh, never mind. There's Metal Sonic. So let me guess. A big wall is gonna come chasing me. 
Okay, now this boss fight's not that hard. The only part I think that's hard about it is that part right there. That's the only part where he just shoots at you. He just doesn't like it at all. That part's easy, though. But the other part where he just randomly just shoots at you in a ball, that's kind of hard. I'm not going to lie. Oh, yeah, there's also that part. I forgot. It, he takes on all his forms he did in the Sonic CD race. So, uh, yeah. You gotta be prepared for that. Oh, Knuckles wasn't prepared for that. Not even the great Knuckles wasn't prepared for that. Like, you could tell he wasn't. Oh, gosh! I wasn't prepared for that either. My gosh. Hello? It wouldn't let me jump. I was I was trying to press jump. It wouldn't even let me jump. Okay, now this game is being cheap. Boom. What? It missed. What? Oh, gosh. I gotta say, they've increased some difficulty, if not anything. Because it does feel a little bit difficult than what it used to feel like. What? Okay, I don't remember it be doing that. Okay, I think they've increased some difficulty, but not much. See, I think the game was on normal mode, so I think this is like hard mode, I guess. Hey, it's better hard mode than what uh, Sonic Forces was. That game didn't even have a hard mode, basically. That game's hard mode was um, easy. Like, seriously, even if you lost your rings a lot, you still got an S rank. <laughs> like, honestly, it wasn't even that, it wasn't even great. It was just kind of trash. Sorry, I hit my mic. Sorry if it made me static. Okay, now we're chasing Metal Sonic. And I'm assuming the the wall's gonna come back. Cause, uh, wait, what? Hello? <gasps> what? Hello? Okay, I don't remember that. This is new. Oh my gosh, look at this. That. Oh, bruh! <laughs> they did increase some difficulty in this, because look at that thing. He's looking like a, a Sonic, a Metal Sonic from Sonic Heroes. Bruh! That was new, okay. Knuckles destroyed him, though. Ow, you little troll. <laughs> bruh! I'm not gonna lie, that was actually pretty cool, I gotta say. They just turned into that thing from like. What was it, like, Sun? I think it was from Knuckles Chaotix, actually, where he did that. But it was pretty cool, I gotta say. I'm glad they brought that back. That was a neat touch. Hey, wait, what? Is that the, uh, boss, the end boss fight of Sonic 2? Death Egg Robot thing? I think I saw it. <gasps> no way! What? <laughs> okay, there we go. At Hyd Hydra City, or as people like to call it, Hydrocity. But no, its actual name is Hydra City. But anyways, here we go, here we are in Sonic and, and uh, Sonic 3's Hydra City Zone. Sorry, I almost called it Hydrocity. And I think that's where we're going to stop off for uh, today's episode. Because, you know, this zone is actually really cool and I actually like it a lot. So yeah, that's what we're going to pick up next time, guys. If you do want to keep seeing more of the series, then you make sure to smash that like button. Um, share it a lot of times. Get it to like, I don't know, a million views. If you do that, I'll be your best friend forever. Until next time, peace, goodbye. Oh yeah. And if somebody ever asks you what Sonic Mania sound you liked, okay, well, you guys can have your own opinion for what song, some song you want from Sonic Mania, which is best. But my all-time favorite Sonic song from Sonic Mania was Stardust Speedway. Act 2 music. Really good. That's my favorite. Alright guys, see you next time. Peace. Oh yeah. Also, one more thing. Bubble Shield! Oh, what? You can't even spam it anymore. Look. <laughs> okay, that felt awkward. Okay, bye guys. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Game Plays. That's right, so, if you didn't watch yesterday's video, I basically went over to Zen Garden Land, and then I went over to Stardust Speedway to have an epic boss fight with Metal Sonic. And uh, yeah, ended off yesterday's videos also by spamming a bubble shield, which you can't do. And uh, yeah, that's where we're continuing off today. So, if you guys do want to keep seeing more of the series, make sure to drop a like. You know, everything helps. Like, seriously, you guys are good at dropping likes. But yeah, here we are in Hydra City, or as see, some people like to call it Hydrocity, which is not even its name. It's actually called, it's actually pronounced Hydra City. Well, depending on its accent, I don't know. Depending on your accent. Wait, what? You can drown with a bubble shield? Oh, that's probably Knuckles. That's probably Knuckles. So yeah, we're going up here with these little things going on. And uh, hopefully we can get up here. Boom! Bubble shield. Whoa, oh gosh! Oh, gosh, that messed me up. Okay, hopefully we can go back over here. Get one right over there. Oh, oh gosh, that's that scares me kind of. Okay, come on. Got it. 
sorry knuckles you're kind of just gonna have to die in the water i'm sorry you know they actually put in like an easter egg i think like nah they patched it never mind there was used to be an easter egg where if you put it in you could like hear the donkey which is a uh, youtuber you actually hear some voice clips of him in there like uh, unlocks donkey mode and you can actually see him i think that's what his name is right but yeah you can like see him and you can hear some voice clips of him that's pretty cool but then they were like, nope, we gotta take that out for some reason. I don't know why they patched it or anything, but they had to it for some reason. Okay, we're gonna use Knuckles here and switch over to Mighty. Hey, we got Mighty. Wait, what is Mighty with a bow shield? Oh, oh, okay, you can't even use it. Okay, whatever. So yeah, here we got Mighty. We're going whoop up into there with the armadillo. Oh, what? Um technical difficulties okay we're going up here then forget that go through the loop de loop we gotta walk on that water boy all right jump pull the switch right here did, did that do anything oh yeah it did and let's go down here okay I kind of sad that I pit, um, did it wherever you can't really spam with the bubble shield now what okay this is weird ow bruh no bruh you can't be doing that to me Oh, okay, I didn't think that actually worked, but who cares? Okay, I'm gonna step on this thing. Boom! Bubble shield! Okay, we're gonna go through there. What? Where my bubble shield go? There it is! Okay. Knuckles just died, although he wasn't even there. Wait, how are we supposed to do this? Okay, wait. You get pushed down there. Oh, okay, so there's like no way to get over there without knuckles. Okay, I get what you're saying. Give me something. Hey, I got a spec Sonic. I mean, not, yeah, knuckles. Sorry, I said Sonic. I meant to say knuckles. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was close. Not even gonna lie. What? There was a spring there? A spring there. Mate. Mate. No, no, no. I'm gonna pretend like that didn't even happen. I got the bubble. Hey, Sonic died that time. Take that, Sonic. That's what you get. You couldn't say that you were just going to be like, oh, yeah, Knuckles is the only one going to die. But nope, your boy Sonic had to go. I'm sorry. He did, but he just had to go. I'm sorry. I, I kind of regret that happening, but he just had to go. I'm sorry. He's just, he's just not a good guy, okay? Oh, my gosh. It feels like that timer comes back every five seconds. My gosh. And I can't even tell if it's for Knuckles or Sonic. Like, that's the bad thing about it. And look, it even popped out when we were in water. I mean, what is that? Oh, yeah. Also, they took out that drowning music that made it look so scary. <laughs> yeah, they took that out. They put the Sonic CD one in it where it's like... Like that. Yeah, they actually put that one in. And I'm actually glad for that because um, that other one kind of scared me. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here we got a boss fight with Eggman. Ew. Is apparently swimming under here and putting these bombs down because he he just likes them bombs. You got you got he got he likes it. He likes to blow places up. That's messed up though. Like oh gosh. Okay, we're gonna need those bubbles. Give me that bubble boy. If Mighty would have killed, took that bubble, then I'd been mad. Okay. But pff, Mighty didn't even get a bubble. Okay, who cares? Who cares about Mighty? Who cares about my ET the armadillo? I only care about Sanic. Sanic the huge hog. <laughs> I don't care nothing about stupid mighty the armada. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alright, no. Oh, gosh, I knew that was gonna happen. I knew it. As soon as I jumped, I knew I was gonna hit that. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this boss fight. This was actually one of my favorite boss fights in the whole game. Oh, oh, no, don't do that. Don't do that one. So, in this boss fight, you basically have to do it. We get to do it to Eggman, what he did to us in Sonic 3. And you gotta make sure you don't get those bombs in there, because uh, if you get those bombs in there. You're not, it's not going to be a good surprise for you. It's going to be pretty bad. So you better make sure that Eggman doesn't put a bomb in there. Because if he slips a bomb in there, you're toast. Okay. He doesn't seem to be putting any bombs. Oh yeah, and also another thing, the bombs always come right behind Eggman. So yeah, that's a thing to look out. Uh, there you go, that's the end of Eggman. He just kind of died in four hits. There you go. Short very short all right so yeah that was the end of Eggman it take that much hit. I think it was like four or five was it six I don't know I think it was like four hits but anyways we're going on to act two now so yay that and uh, let's just see how this is so 
you. And I actually have to say, Act 2 is a lot better than Act 1 was in Hydra City. Well, once I remember. And you know, it's called Hydra City, and it's supposed to be all watery, but you look at the background, you see all that red stuff, so it's also got like some red water in it. I don't know. The water seems to be fine. Background's red, though, so that could be questionable. Okay, give me that bubble. Beat those piranhas up. Those piranhas, man, don't don't even get me started on those things. Like, bruh, don't don't talk. Don't 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 bring those up, okay? Just don't bring them up. Okay. Oh gosh. Oh, <sighs> burgers, man, burgers. <laughs> I know that's a weird thing to say when you get hit, but hey, it's better than like swearing. <laughs> this is nice and kid friendly. <laughs> you know what's not nice and kid friendly is Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> what? I thought that was Mighty's timer, okay. What, we gotta restart the whole thing over? Are you serious? Okay. <laughs> Bruh, I could have sworn that was Mighty's timer. I didn't think it was mine. I wasn't even panicking. I was just like, okay, whatever, it's just Mighty's timer. Nothing's it's gonna happen. Like, honestly, stuff did have to happen. Do 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 Sorry, sorry, I know I shouldn't sing, but it's so catchy. Boom, gotcha, boy. Okay. Oh wow, that water actually looks kind of cool. Looks like it has a bunch of mucus in it though. So. What? You can't be hitting me right as I get back to the ground. What is that? Okay, I'm gonna tell you right now. I don't think this was in the normal version of this, because I don't remember it being like this. Like, every time you get out of that little wave thing that it actually gets hit. Like, I don't remember that. <laughs> of course, then again, like I said, in like almost every single one of these videos, and I say this every single time I record this, I don't remember the game, okay? It's totally, it's a brand new game for me, okay? I haven't played this game since like March, so yeah. My next Sonic playthrough will probably be like in September where I play um, Sonic Adventure, and then I'll play uh, Sonic Adventure 2 probably in like November. I might do a stream of forces if you guys want that, but I don't know if I'll be able to do that or not, but if I do, then you know, I'll do it. Then I'll probably do Sonic Generations sometime. I might do Sonic Generations in November, actually, because it's actually its anniversary. Because that game actually did come out in November, so. Yay. Okay, so now we're going to go over here. There's a little spin dash here. Yep, boom, get that up there. Remember that. Back from, like, the original one. Okay, now I'm going to fly up here by using these little fans. Do, 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 do. Okay, now we're just going to climb up here. Jump up here. Okay, nice. Oh, shoes. I actually remember this thing from like Sonic 3. This is like one of my favorite Sonic 3 levels. Like, I don't know. It's just so good. <laughs> I remember the first time I beat Sonic 3. I think it was on my... Yeah, I think it was on my Wii. I beat Sonic 3. I didn't get the Chaos Emeralds because at the time I didn't even understand what you're supposed to do. Hey, I was like five years old, okay? You wouldn't know either. <laughs> So I went in there and like it's like collect blue spear. So I did it and I got bored of it. So I just like killed myself on purpose, so I could just go back to the main game. Then there was parts wherever I would like like at the time I like played a lot of Mario. So like in Mario, New Super Mario Brothers Wii, there was like a World Nine. So I always thought when you jumped in those special rings, it was like a World Nine. So I was like, ah, I just teleported to World Nine. It's so cool. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that, but. Hey, I, hey, I was like five, okay? Like I said, I was like five. So yeah, those are some memories I have of Sonic 3. I also remember I really liked Knuckles. Knuckles was like one of my favorite Sonic characters. He was like really cool. I always thought Knuckles was like a spaghetti monster. I, don't, I know that sounds like complete nonsense to people, but honestly, I was like five. Like I said, I didn't know any better. I thought he was like a spaghetti monster thing with, <laughs> with boxing gloves. I didn't know, okay? <laughs> That probably sounded so weird, but I swear, I always thought he was a spaghetti monster. And then you had, like, Sonic over here. I like Sonic, because I didn't even care what Sonic was. I didn't even know he could talk or anything. I just thought he was a hedgehog. I didn't even know what a hedgehog was. I just thought, what is this blue thing I'm looking at? <laughs> okay, so I've actually never done this boss fight without um, Super Sonic, so yeah. Wait, what is these? What is that? Oh, okay. Whoa! Okay. 
So hit that thing. Oh, okay, I get it. Hey, this boss fight's actually not that bad. Okay, go down here. Go up here. Oh gosh, the clock is ticking. Oh no, or is that Knuckles? Is that Knuckles timer? Please tell me it's Knuckles. Please tell me it was Knuckles. It better be Knuckles. Nope. Oh, it was Knuckles. Okay, thank goodness. Ah, gosh. Hey, we got him. Hey. Now it's time for the troll. Eggman's actually not done yet. He's got this thing. Remember this thing from Sonic 3? People who've played Sonic 3 probably remember this guy. People who've never played Sonic 3 probably don't even know what this thing is and why it's so special. But I played Sonic 3 and I remember this thing. Boom! That was so easy with Knuckles. I'm not gonna lie. Knuckles kind of destroyed that boss fight. That was broken. Okay. What? Okay, forget this. Hey, you just look up there and see Knuckles. He's like, yeah, I'm cool. You got Mighty over there, you know, flexing his muscles. And then you got that water. Whoa, okay. Well, I love how Mighty just stands there. He's just like, what? What? Hey, we got Mirage Saloon. Oh, what? I don't remember this part. Oh, this must be the Knuckles part. Yeah, I actually never did the Knuckles part of this stage. Because he got a completely, total new act than what Sonic did, so. Yeah. Okay, now this is probably like one of the best sounds in the game. Like this one's so chill. Like seriously, that song is so good. Hey look, you got those vines from Sonic 3 right there. I love how they put some Sonic 3 stuff in here. That's pretty cool. I mean, they already had Sonic 3 stuff in here, but still, I like how they're putting it more in. I really wish you could get Sonic 3 remastered, but like they need to fix a way to get over the estate things and stuff to fix that, so they can, so we can actually get that game. Because I really want it so bad. I, I love Sonic 3. That's my favorite Sonic. My, one, yeah, one of my favorite 2D Sonic games ever. Mania, it's pretty good, but I think Sonic 3 Knuckles is like better in a way that is. This one's great, but I just really love Sonic 3, probably because I've grown up with that one. Like that's a game I've played a lot, and you know I just like it. You know, Sonic Mania, it's good, but it also brings back a lot of memories of me playing the f 1, 2, and 3. Like, a lot of that. And Sonic CD 2. Of course, I didn't play Sonic CD till I got an iPod Touch back in uh, 2013, so... Yeah, without that, I didn't even know what a Sonic CD was. At the time of that, I only knew what Sonic 1, 2, and 3 were. In fact, I didn't even know Sonic 4 Episode 2 was even a thing. <laughs> And I would actually I honestly like to see Sonic 4 Episode 3, but it got cancelled. I don't know why it did, but it just got cancelled for some reason. But it, I'm glad it did, because we got Mania out of it, so yay. But you know, people are like, Sonic 4 is not good. But I actually think Sonic 4, like, Sonic 4 is not great, but it's not bad. It's not terrible. I would say it's decent. And you know, Sonic Mania is the true Sonic 4. Yes, it actually is. And Sonic 4 is just kind of a... I don't know. I guess you could just say, Nope, I don't care about Sonic 4. Because, you know, who cares about it? Okay, now I don't understand why it's not giving me any lives because... Oh, wait, there's one. Okay. Please be Sonic! Hey, we got him. Nice. Okay, now we gotta run on water. Woo! Alright, go bounce up here on the confetti. Well, that's not confetti. I don't know why I said confetti. I was like, jump on the confetti. I don't know what I was thinking. But oh my gosh, this is completely different than the, uh, what's it called? The plane section in the original one. Like, this is this is a total new area. It's pretty cool. I actually like that better than the part where you just flew around and tell his plane, like, kill that caterpillar monster thing. That was a caterpillar monster thing. That was pretty tough. I'm not gonna lie. What? Oh, okay. I was wondering what was going on there. Okay, oh, oh, don't touch that thing. Okay, checkpoint, good. You know what, let's go in the checkpoint. I actually want to play some pinball. Oh my gosh, the pixels on this, though, the pixels. Okay, please, give me something. Oh, wow, the pinball things won't even work. The flippers, they won't even work. I like how Eggman's just up there. He's just like, hi, how are you? What? 
Okay, never mind then. I didn't even get the chance to get one of those. Okay. So yeah, guys, my pinball skills aren't very good. Wait, how are you supposed to... Oh, you just push it. Okay. I, over, I was overthinking that. But, oh, gosh. I am glad I didn't slam down on that spike. Oh, but actually, it wouldn't matter because I was mighty. Hey. <laughs> mighty. Been slamming down on spikes since 1993. Wait. Oh, I don't have mighty anymore. I don't have broken man. He's not even a man. He's an armadillo. Got to get that right. Do, 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 do. Jumping in this gun, because that's totally not deadly. <gasps> oh yeah, I forgot to mention, um, if you guys didn't know, this stage was actually supposed to be in Sonic CD for the mobile devices and PC. This was supposed to be Desert Dazzle, but the guy who made it, Christian Whitehead, for like mobile devices, yeah, he was trying to get like a stage in here, Desert Dazzle, which was originally based off something from Sonic 2. He was actually trying to get it in here. But he couldn't for some reason, and then he just added it into this game. He's like, no, no, I've tried this. I've tried this once. We're doing it again. You know, he just did it. You know, Sega's been trying it for years. They put it in, they were trying to put it in Sonic 2, but how are you supposed to get in there? I don't know. But anyways, they were trying to put it in Sonic 2, but it got scrapped. And they put it in the Sonic CD, and then stuff happened. They couldn't do it. But then the, after the third time, they were like, okay, we're doing it. And it's made, boom, Mirage Saloon. And there you go. That's how you got this desert theme level. And I'm not going to lie, it's one of my favorite levels in this whole game. Oh, that, no, no, I'm, I'm getting flashbacks. <gasps> Wait a minute. I remember this guy. He was from, he was from, um, what's it called? Sonic Chaos for the uh, Master System. <gasps> no, what? I actually remember this. This was the boss fight when I played that game. I could never get past. I remember it. Because that made me hate this, that made hate that game so much. Because I could never get through it. But boy, is it easy now. Bro, I remember that. Like, I'm glad they put that in there. Give me another flashback. Like, I didn't even think about that guy until I saw it just now. Like, yeah, I don't really forgot about that game. Completely existing. I actually beat Sonic Chaos, believe it or not. I actually beat it for PC a couple days ago. Well, actually, it was like a few months ago. Actually, it was like Christmas time. I actually beat it. I beat it in a day. It was a short game. Basically, Sonic Forces, but the old edition of it. It was too simple. All right, so now we're getting these rings up here. Now, Act 2, I don't really care about that much. It's kind of good. But I actually, like, wait a minute, Fang. Fang the sniper, or Fang the weasel. It, it looks more like a wolf than, to me than a, a weasel. Okay, boom. Oh, gosh, okay, come on. There we go. Okay, I actually like how it's nighttime now. That's actually cool. Okay, get shot through a gun. Boom! Hey, look, there's Bean the Dynamite from Sonic Fighters. Sonic the Fighters, sorry. I actually played that game on PS now. I actually really liked it. I mean, it's no Smash Bros, but it's pretty good. Whoa! Okay, hello there, Armadillo. You're allowed to put bars in a kid's game? I did not, I was not aware of that. <laughs> the things you can do these days. <laughs> now where's, where's Bart the polar bear? I want to see that guy. Okay, hit that signpost right there. Oh, there he is. Wonderful. Okay, whoa, oh my gosh, that armadillo, oh my gosh, an armadillo just got wrecked by another armadillo, that's kind of sad, not gonna lie, that's kind of sad, wait, can Mighty still jump on spikes, or, <laughs> oh, I forgot he could even do that, oh, that was perfectly timed, what, boy, you can't be doing this to me, see that, that's how the Sega likes to troll you, they get you going real fast, and then they just throw something in your way to mess you up, not gonna lie, that's kind of a trash move, Okay, I hate this armadillos, man. They get in your way so much. Okay, I'm glad you can do that as Mighty. I'm really glad you can do that. Oh, get out of my way, boy. Okay, push that now way up in the water. Hey, up, 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 up. Okay, I'm gonna actually jump up here. There we go, nice. Can I jump up here on these little things? Oh, Caterpillar, oh gosh, I knew that was gonna happen. I knew it. 
I need to work on timing my jumps better. I mean, I do it pretty well, but whenever I'm trying to dodge something, I don't. I need to start practicing rolling up in a ball as soon as I run, because I realize that's kind of messed me up a lot of times. Oh, what? What is this? Oh, hello there, magician. Oh, yeah, I didn't know this, actually, until I like, was watching this video, but apparently that's supposed to be a, a lady robot. I didn't even know that. I always thought it was a guy, but no, it's a lady. Sorry. Okay, so now we're having everybody fight the classics. Also hearing some Game Gear music in there when you lose a ring. That's actually what that sound effect is. Zoom! Oh, oh, it's Bark the Polar Bear. Get wrecked, little buddy. Get wrecked. Okay, no, no, Bark, Bark, don't hit me. Don't hit me, Bark. I always mange you in Sonic the Fire. I'm just kidding. I didn't even use him. I used Sonic, and that was it. And I beat up Tails. And then I got the special ending, because I got... I forget how you get the special ending, but... I think you can, like... Can't you win, like, Super Sonic in that game? I think you can. Like the Final Fight or something. Anyways. There we go. That was the end of that. Boom! Another Victory Royale. Alright, my E.T. got to Act 2. Well, that's, isn't that wonderful? Alright, so now we're going on to the next act, which is... Wait, is it Lava Reef Zone? No, it's Oil Ocean. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. That's, that's not good. This, no. No. Oh, gosh. I'm not gonna lie, though. It looks pretty cool. It's also got some pretty good music. Yeah, I think I'm gonna end off here with just them dancing. Alright, bye guys. Mighty and Knuckles got them moves! Hey, what's up guys? Geep here once again back with another video and guess what? Today we're gonna be playing some more Sonic Mania, that's right. So last time we went over to Hydra City Zone and Mirage Saloon, now we're going on over to Oil Ocean Zone, that's right. It's not a good stage, I don't know why I'm so excited for it. It's kind of making me question my life. Okay, so there's a fire shield right there, gonna hit that very good, very good, very good, very good. All right, now if you don't get the fire shield, you can do the best. Uh, probably one of the greatest things in a Sonic game ever. You can set fire to oil ocean. Y you get it? Fire oil? You get it? Eh, no? Okay. <laughs> but once you set fire to this place, I'm gonna tell you it's really satisfying or oddly satisfying. Never thought I would enjoy you saying I I enjoyed burning this places down into little pieces of fire. <laughs> But yeah, there you go. There's Sonic Mania Plus in its biggest, greatest form. Fire Zone Act 1 and Fire Zone Act 2. Well, fire, well, the second one's Fire and Smoke Act 2, but the first one's just Fire. And yeah, if you lose the shield, it takes away from the fun. So I would try to not do that because uh, if you do, you won't get messed up, boy. All right, so we're gonna go down the slide. Woo! Go down there. All right, nice. Okay, whoa, fire everywhere. Okay, look out for those little octopus. Look out for the octopus, okay. Okay, go up here, jump. Gotta time that jump just right. There we go, okay, we did that pretty good. All right. Good. Dodge little seahorses. Don't wanna get over them, cause they, whoa, okay. Oh, whoa, ooh, that was close. Okay, we're going down a fire slide. You, you've heard a water slide, but have you ever heard of a fire slide? No, you have not. Okay, hop them here. All right, nice. All right, yep. Yeah, oh, gosh. Ooh, okay, watch out for spikes. Don't get in your way. Ooh, ooh, almost touched that spring. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay. Slowly going down here. Okay, there's a checkpoint right there. I'm gonna hit that. Boom. Let's go in the pinball machine. Because I want to see this. Okay, here we go. At the pinball. So if you remember last time I played pinball, it didn't end too well. It ended up with me getting absolutely nothing. Just kind of just being wasteful. Okay. Oh, I wanted tails. Why? Come on, give me tails game. Whoa! Oh! Oh, come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Give me tails! Give me tails! Ooh. 
Nice, okay. No, no, no! Gosh, I wanted tails. Why? And we got rid of our fire shield for an electric shield. Why? Why? Oh well, say goodbye to fire ocean zone. Back to electricity zone, I guess. I don't know. But hey, that's the end. And here's Bob the Robot. Bob the Robot. Can we fix it? Bob the Robot. No, we can't actually. Um... You know, don't don't question that. We, we we can't fix it, okay? It's it's we can't fix it. It's unfixable. Is that, is that a word? <laughs> unfixable? I don't know. But there you go. That's the end. Whoa. Okay, that don't look like smoke. That that looks weird. Like I don't know what that is. That's that's kind of scary. Not gonna lie. Boy, look at the, look at those clouds! Like, look at this. It's it's kind of fire, I guess. Whoa! Oh yeah, Oil Ocean Two is like Standopolis. Oh, don't get me started on Sandopolis, because I don't like. That was the one stage in Sonic Three that I absolutely hated. Like seriously, you go through that thing, you'll get to like this certain part, wherever there's like this part wherever like the stuff starts to get like ghosts on the screen. You have to like hit these lights to make the ghosts go away. I didn't find that frustrating. What I found frustrating was trying to get through that maze, and there was like a slide you had to go down to, and everything. It was like really complicated. But you know they put it in this game, so. <sighs> So yeah, this is Oil Ocean Act 2, or Sandopolis, basically, and uh, it's not very good, I'm not gonna lie, but it does have some good music in it, I'm not gonna lie, it has some pretty good music in it, and uh, yeah, pretty much Sandopolis mixed with oil, not bad of a stage. Alright, so we're just gonna dodge over these spikes right here, alright, nice. Bounce on the octopus, bounce on the little, um, what's it called? seahorse and a slide down the little water fountain well not the water fountain sorry the water slide i don't know what a water fountain has to do with any of this but i do see something kind of in the background looks like a water fountain but then again that has absolutely nothing to do with this video okay now i gotta hit this thing right here set fire to the place jump in this thing okay please tell me we can get tails come on tails come on bounce oh, oh, oh come on <laughs> Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> now, okay, that time I didn't even try, like, at all. I've gotten to where I'm getting trashed at those pinball stages, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, time to go down the fire slide. <gasps> oh my gosh, that, that's kind of messed up, I'm not gonna lie. You see Armadillo on fire sliding down something and just catching fire to the whole thing, yeah. Look at that. I can't say I'm happy, though, because it is pretty happy. I'm, I'm glad to see the stage finally burning in fire. That's where it should have been originally. Shouldn't have been in Sonic 2. I would have rather any other stage. What, really? Oh yeah, I forgot Mighty cannot take damage to spikes. Like, clearly, that's broken. Mighty is so broken. Ray, all, all he's got is the Super Mario cape. But, you know, Mighty, he's pretty breakable. He, he can't take hits by any projectiles. He can't be hit by spikes. And, yeah, he's just breakable. And he can, like, slam into the ground. So, yeah, Mighty, um, he's pretty, he's pretty broken. I'm saying. More broken than Sonic Tails or Knuckles could ever be. I'm gonna tell you that. Okay, we're trying this again. At this time, we're not gonna make a fool out of ourselves. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Nice. Okay, come on. Okay. Oh, we missed it. We missed the shield, too. Okay, yeah. Boom. Come on. Oh. Da boom. There we go. Got it. Okay. Oh, I got a fire shield with the fire shield. Okay. Oh, well, we moved up a little bit. Okay. What? No, 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 Hit it, hit it, hit it. Oh, gosh. Whoa, okay. Okay, nacho, nacho. Nacho, no! Gosh! Oh, I want Tails so bad. Tails would make this stage so much better because he could usually just fly over the whole thing. But then again, I do like making the place and get the place on fire with Mighty. I'm not going to lie. I, I do enjoy that. So don't think I don't. Oh, we're going underwater. Okay. I actually like this part a lot. It's like a really good because you go in this little sub. Then actually go in here and there's like more to the adventure. So yeah, kind of glad they added this part in because it does add to the... Um, 
Act 2 fill of this stage, because the first one, yeah, it's the same, but this one's a little different, and Sandopolis Anna adds that feature. It also adds a feature of that, which a lot of people actually like, I'm not gonna lie. Just make sure Shadow doesn't come here, because he'll be smoking up in here, and we don't want that. And I uh, just took damage from that, why? I'm gonna have to find another fire shield now, mate. It's not good. Yeah, boom. Let me get in here. Rest in peace, Knuckles. Some stay that Knuckles is still under that water today. Okay. Boom. Boom. Okay. Boom. Okay. Ow, oh, you got him, Knuckles. Good job. Okay. Yeah, boom. Boom. Go down here. Wee. Okay, jump down here. Boom. Got him. Okay, there's a little mixer match right there. Alright. Where's Knuckles? Knuckles, come here. I don't want to switch Mighty. I want to switch you. Sonic! Hey, we got Sonic! And Tails! Yeah! Sonic and Tails! The classic duo that used to... Ma oh, wait, that's Ray. That's Ray the Flying Squirrel. Pff, I thought that was Tails. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, they look very similar. Oh, yeah, Tails is in here. He's trapped in here. Everybody's outside except Tells you strapped in this pinball machine. We gotta go save him because I don't know my pinball skills are kind of trash I'm not gonna lie and you know, they're the only way we can get Tells out of here and well I don't I don't think we're gonna be getting him out here anytime soon Okay, Tells I got you Oh so close so close Okay, I got you Tails. I got you. Let's do this again. Come on Tails. Okay, it's right after that. Yes! Tails! Forget anything else. We got that. We got Tails. Forget everything else. We got Tails, the, the coolest guy around. Well, the coolest fox around, I guess. And, uh, yeah, there you go. That's... that. We got the whole peoples there. We got all six of them. Mighty, Ray, Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles. There we go. The way it was supposed to be, but the way it wasn't. Anybody kind of disappointed that Amy wasn't in this game? I know that sounds really messed up coming from me, but, um... I don't know, I think she could be in there. She could be a clone of Sonic, I guess. I don't know. But it just seems, like, really left out. And they could have added her, I guess. But I would have went for Big the Cat more than her, but... <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I would know... No, I'd really like to see a 2D Big the Cat. That actually would be pretty cool to see that. Oh, gosh. No, no, don't fall. Don't fall. Come on. Come on, Sonic. Come on, Sonic. You gotta... Ooh, there we go. Come on, Sonic. Ow, Sonic. Okay, jump. Come on, Sonic. There we go. Okay. No, no, don't press that. Oh, gosh. Okay, clip back up there. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Oh, gosh. What is this control? Oh, no. Oh, no. As Knuckles will say in Sonic Adventure. As Knuckles will say in Sonic Adventure. Okay. Thank goodness that's there, because if that wasn't there, we'd be dead. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Yes, hit it. Nice. Okay, oh, come on. Oh, I messed that up so bad. But I get another chance at it. Oh, gosh. Sonic Spinball, is that you? Okay, come on. I get another shot. Yes. Oh. Yes! Okay, I got it. Oh gosh, no I didn't. Oh my gosh, this is kind of difficult. Oh, do we get it? Oh, what do we get? After this, what do you get? Oh, we got a normal shield. Okay, that's fine. So you literally just keep doing this over and over until you get the shield you want? I mean, that's kind of broken, but not really. I guess you could get so many rings here. Like, there you go. Rings. Rings! There we go, bubble shield. This is so broken, you could literally just keep doing this for like hours. You get so many continues too. Okay, where's that fire shield at? There it is! Oh wait, no, that's a normal shield. Oh, 
Okay, so I guess there you go. That's the end of the pinball thing. You just go all the way up, and then there's the end. And uh, I kind of don't want to do this anymore, so... <laughs> yeah. There you go, guys. That's the end of the pinball thing. When you get to the end, that's the end. And now it's back to more... Um... Fire. Yay. Oh, yeah. I forgot we got Ray and Sonic this time. Okay, Ray. Let's do this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, there we go. See, I'm getting used to Ray's controls a lot. It's pretty breakable once you get to know... Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, wait. I forgot. That's the one thing I don't like about Ray is when you attack, you've got to stop flying. It's... I don't know what, what that is, but just something about it just really messes me up. Probably because I'm used to Sonic and, I don't know. Ray is the controls feel good, but you just have to make sure you remember to let go once you're done flying to attack. That's the only thing about Ray. Because if you don't, you get hit. And then sometimes like that, you just get hit with no Ray. Oh, thank you, Sonic. Thank you for taking that hit. Thanks, buddy. Oh, gosh! Okay, I'm being Sonic. I'm sorry, Ray, but I just, I'm better with Sonic, okay? I'll take it personal, but I'm better with Sonic than Ray. My gosh. Boom. Oh my gosh, you know, Eggman wasn't fooling around when he built this thing. Oh gosh, I just realized we have zero rings. Oh wait, never mind. Ray just went down there and got one. Thank you, Ray. You're a true friend. <laughs> and he's taking all the hits for me. Oh my gosh, Tells doesn't even take this much hits. Oh, I knew that was going to happen as soon as I jumped. Why? Boom. Okay, come on, come on. Don't fall, don't fall, Sonic. If you fall, I swear. Sonic, Sonic, don't fall. Sonic. Oh, no. Oh, we are one hit. We are one shot. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I don't know how I feel about this. I mean, one little mess up and we're dead. Better make it count. Oh, yes, yeah, Sonic got the hit. Thank you, Sonic. Your true friend. Forget you, Ray. I'm better with Sonic than I am. Sorry, Ray. But hey, at least you got to see Ray's victory animation. It's literally him just wagging his thumbs around like. <laughs> okay, now let's see what's going on here. Oh, what? What's going on here? Whoa! Okay, that's a new one. I forgot what the next act was. Oh, yeah, it's Lava Reef. Okay. Whoa! Bro, let me tell you, they stepped it up since Sonic 3. My gosh! <laughs> um, this place is looking... I don't know. It's kind of looking a lot like the underworld right now. Not gonna lie. It's kind of scary, honestly. But yeah, you got all this stuff going on. And as you can tell, I think this is actually new. I don't think this was in the original one. But there you go, that's, this is Lava Reef Zone, the, the stage of, well, I actually like the stage a lot, the music's really good, and I actually like this a lot. This is probably one of my favorite Sonic 3 levels, too, after Ice Cap and stuff, probably my Sonic, my favorite Sonic and Knuckles stage, probably. It's just really good. Okay, I'm gonna use Ray, oh, never mind. Okay, whatever. I was, I was gonna say I was gonna use Ray, but never mind. Okay, boom! Oh, I'm Tails, oh, yes, I'm Tails, hey, how you doing, Tails? Jimmy, come on, come on, Tails, come on, Let's pick up Sonic, pick up Sonic, Tails, it's not hard, I forget it, I'll be Sonic, and just do it that way, oh, well, you can't, okay, well, whatever, I know, look at even the computer's like, okay, I want Tails, but it won't even let you, okay, Tails, I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to get swapped, hey, it's Mighty and Sonic, okay, even better, okay, we got the whole, um, six of them, I think, we got Sonic, Mighty, Knuckles, Ray, and Tails. Yep, that's all of them. There's not six of them, there's five of them. My bad. It just feels so off having five characters. I believe they could have added someone else in there. Anybody else feel like that? Like they could have added someone else that was forgotten. Like Bark the Polar Bear. Well, actually, they put it Bark the Polar Bear in here. Um, let's see, I'm trying to think of another one. Oh, yeah, what about Heavy and Bomb? I haven't seen them in a while. Um, if you guys would like, I would do a Knuckles Chaotix Let's Play, because I actually kind of want to do that now. Honestly, wouldn't ma mind doing that, because that actually would make a pretty cool Let's Play, because I've only played through some of that game, and from what I've played of it, it's a really good game. But 
But you know, I didn't really play that one that much because it's okay for me. But I did use Heavy and Bomb a lot because I don't know. Wait, in that game wasn't um, Heavy and Bomb like those tag team guys, right? With the uh, weight thing and like Heavy. Yeah, those guys. Yeah, I wish they were back in this game. They actually could be really good in this game. Like they could be like a, I don't know, like a bit like a mini boss or something. It's like Sega. How dare you replace us or something? I don't know. They they probably think of something clever to do. I don't know. Okay, anyways, we're gonna be Sonic right here. Oh gosh, electricity! It jumps, bounce, bounce. Cut those rings. Click those rings. Keep out. Oh no, I don't think so. Okay, hit this little switch right there. Got another special stage thing. Let's see what up there. Oh yeah, special stage rings. I completely forgot about those. Yeah, if you guys didn't uh, watch other episodes, I told you guys that on the last one we're just gonna beat it and then get the normal ending. Then we're gonna go back and get the special ending. That's what we're gonna do. And then after that, well, this series is over. We can go on to the next Sonic game, which will probably be Sonic Adventure. Not probably in sep sometime in September. So, yay. Then we got another time, which will be in. Um, I guess we could do like Sonic Generations in November because about that time it'd probably be there. And then we can do Sonic Adventure, and then we can do Sonic Adventure 2, Sonic Ge Sonic Generations, and there you go, that's the end of Sonic. Then I'll take a break of Sonic and work on something else. I don't know what the time, what we're gonna do right now. Oh gosh! No! That was, oh my gosh. I even timed that just right to dodge the lava, and then I got hit by the spikes. Like, what is this? Like, what, what is this? Okay, bounce up there. Oh, okay. Alright, then you got this goal post right there. Okay, nice. Bounce up there. Oh gosh, look up the rocks. Actually, let me just switch to Mighty. He seems a lot more breakable than Sonic does. He can, like, dodge all this stuff. So, yeah, let's be him. Wait, can he dodge fire? Okay, no, I was testing that out. Because if he could dodge fire, that'd be so broken. What? Okay, a mine. I thought it was going to hit. I thought you could go through there. But, eh, who cares? Oh my gosh, this is looking beautiful. Like, it's hard to think that this game's actually 16-bit, because it's actually looking like a 32-bit game. Not even gonna lie. It looks so clean. Like, honestly. Like, with all these HD graphics and everything, like, this looks beautiful. Look at the background of that. That'd actually make a good YouTube background for any retro gamers or something. That's actually a really cool background. You know the fan base is gonna get a hold of that one. Oh my gosh. The only time I think um, Mighty kind of get a little... Um, where you don't really like him that much is because um, the only problem with Mighty really is just slamming down on the ground. Like, you'll think you're just gonna, like, like, I'll be playing Sonic and I'll just, like, press um, X while I'm jumping just to, like, I don't know what it is. It's kind of like a Sonic 3 instinct where, like, you want to try to double jump, but there's no double jump, just like the Insta Shield. Yeah, if you're trying to think of an Insta Shield with Mighty, you're gonna do this, and then you're probably gonna result in falling into something or something else. Oh, look, it's Knuckles and Re a Mighty. Okay. And gosh, with the, these, uh, that thing is so annoying. That thing that just shoots out those rocks. That is so annoying. I'm not even gonna lie. That messed me up so much this whole time. Okay, guys, quick edit right there. Sorry about that. Anyways, there was like an error or something that happened when I was trying to do this boss fight where I would hit him, but it wouldn't register as a hit. It was so weird. I don't even know what it was. But we're just gonna do the old hit him and don't really care, like the one ring method I talked about in like my other episodes. Oh gosh. Come on, please rings, please rings. Yes, I got it. Nope, switch to right, switch to right. Get it. Oh, there we go. Nice. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna be doing that method today, and hopefully it'll work. Okay, I'm gonna switch to knuckles here. And I just realized something. The reason why I couldn't do this boss fight is I actually thought you were supposed to hit him. You're actually not. You're supposed to wait for the lava to hit him. Oh my gosh, really? There's like a ball that just fell from the sky, really? Oh gosh! Holy moly. Oh, gosh. Okay. There we go. We got a hit in there. All right. Oh. Watch out, Ray. This man's this man's mad at us. This man. This man is mad at us. Okay. Yep. Yeah, boom. All right. Now, what do you do now? Is my question. Just try to get a hit in before he turns to lava. Oh, yep. That's the point. At this time, if you actually don't, if you actually get messed up this time, then it's over. But there we go, we did it. Okay, there we go. Finally, it didn't mess up. All right, now we're going on to Act Two, and oh boy, I bet this will be fun. All right, so yeah, Act Two is basically Act Two. If you ever played Sonic Three, you probably know what this act is about. Because oh, I thought he was gonna fall to his death. Okay. So yeah, this is basically the Sonic Three version where I'm pretty sure everything turns blue. But oh. They changed it up a bit. 
It's now purple. Okay. All right. I, I see you. I see you, Sega. I see you. All right. This is looking pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Like this is looking pretty clean. Like honestly, it's looking really good. I actually really like this. Listen to the music. I don't remember it being that good. Bruh, that's so good. Okay, so forget when I said the other one had a great, great music. It's probably better. Like, it's so good. Like, I like how it's, like, smoothing. It's so calm. Like, it's so... I don't know. You could, it's like it's like trying to tell you something. It's probably telling you, like, okay, stop listening to the music. Get on! <laughs> but, oh my gosh, is there, like, a character that's immune to fire in a Sonic game? Because if there was, I definitely want to be him right now. Oh, yeah, Fire Sonic. Forgot about him. Oh, finally a fire shield. My gosh. About time. Huh. I'm immune to your fire now, loser. Huh. Hi, Eggman. Huh. Joke's on you now, Eggman. Huh. Huh, huh, huh. <laughs> Alright, so now we're gonna go up. Oh, gosh! Oh, I forgot we were immune to that, too. So, yeah, if you get a fire shield in this act, you're pretty much immune to everything except spikes or falling to your death. And no, honestly, Eggman's really tricky about those spikes. You'll put them in the somewhere you don't even least expect them. Oh gosh! Okay, bounce, get up here, climb, bounce up, go, go, climb. Okay, good. Oh gosh! Okay, oh that was clean. That was clean. Okay, you jump, get down here, jump, boom, boom. All right, go down here, climb, 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 climb to the very top, jump, climb. All right, switch a Maru. Yeah, why not? Yeah, we got Sonic. Okay. Wait, wait, I wanted to do Ray. Why? Oh, never mind. Okay. Just do Mighty. He's pretty broken. Oh, yeah. This is OP. Bruh. We can't do... Look how broken this is. We can literally not get hit by spikes and we're immune to fire. Bruh. This is broken. Like, this is broken. Like, I'm not fooling around anymore. This is... This is broken. Like, honestly, it's so broken. Because you can literally not get hit by spikes and you're immune to fire. Bruh. Okay, Mighty is my new favorite Sonic character. Can't get enough of him. Love you. Love you, Mighty. You're my E.T. I love you, my E.T. Love him. Love him. He's cool. He's cool. Alright, so now we're gonna get these rings down here. Alright, nice. Go down here. We've got some crystals going on here. Okay. Fire's coming up. Okay, good. Good for good for that. Alright, good. Boom! There we go. There we go. Got some momentum going. Alright, makes me wonder, what Act 2 are we gonna get? Are we gonna get Knuckles, or are we gonna get a mix of them? Because I know Knuckles had his own boss fight for this. It was really cool, but... I don't know. Because this is like a mix between the characters. So it's hard to tell what you're going to get. And the parts that were originally um, Knuckles are now everyone's. So, yay. Huh. We don't really have a flying character. And I don't want to get in there. I don't want to get in there. Because we're not missing any t characters except Tails. But if you got Ray, then there's no point of getting Tails. Because they're practically the same. Except one's Mario and one's Tails. But, hey, we got a trophy. Without a trace. I don't know if you guys can see it when I get trophies or not. But I literally just got a trophy. Alright, bounce up here. Woo! Alright, nice. We got it. Okay. Whoa. Okay. All right, nice. Okay, bounce. Yep. Boom. All right, there we go. Nice. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Ooh, that was close. Okay. All right. Bounce, 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 bounce. Bounce up in the air. Bounce up. Don't be scared. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop. All right, spin dash down here. Whoa. Okay, nice. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look out for those things. Okay, this is actually really easy. I'm not gonna lie. This is pretty easy. Okay, Sonic. I don't really want. Nah, I don't want to switch. That's that's kind of a risk. I don't really want to do that. Come on. There we go. Alright, nice. Jump up here. Doing pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. We're actually doing pretty good. Bro, this music, though, it's so good. Like, I don't, I don't know. And the background, too. The background's amazing. Like, look at that. That's, like, that's incredible. Oh, do we get Knuckles? We get Knuckles part? Bro, please tell me we get the Knuckles part. Come on, please tell me we get that. Come on. Come on. Do we get Knuckles fight? Where, like, it's the thing where the heavy thing has the... Oh, wait, never mind. It's this one. I remember this. Okay, so this guy's riding a moto mug. And, oh my gosh. 
Okay, I didn't realize it was that hard without Supersonic, because usually I'd have Supersonic at this part. Oh, gosh! Okay, we're lucky we got Mighty and a Fire Shield. We're really lucky. Poor Sonic, though. He's getting abused. <laughs> wow, I love how Mighty just did that little pose right there as he hit him, and Sonic's, like, literally screaming for help. He's like, what is this madness? Mighty's like, huh, you can't touch me. But, do you see how broken this is? Mighty is literally so broken. Look, you don't even take damage to that thing. Look at that. And then, look, you can just hit him. You can keep hitting with it. Oh, look at that. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> so broken. I'm not even gonna lie. Ha. Huh? Mighty is so broken, though. Like, <laughs> bruh. Mighty, Mighty is like a buffed version of Sonic and Tails, Knuckles, and everything. Like, honestly. He's so buffed. Look at Sonic, though. Like, look at them together. Oh, they're good friends. That's what Knuckles should have been. Knuckles should have been Mighty. I honestly wish Knuckles would have placed him. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but, bruh, that was really cool. Wait, what? Oh, <gasps> what is that? Oh, yeah. Now we're going on to Metallic Madness. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Alright, guys. So in the next episode, I'm going to be doing Metallic Madness. And I think... Is there one more? I think there's Titanic Monarch after that. We're going to be doing those two stages. And then, there you go. That's the end. But, yeah, that's pretty much the end of Sonic Mania. So, I think I'm going to, like, this is going to be six parts together. But, yeah, that's going to be the end of Sonic Mania. All right, guys. So, tune in next time we go through uh, Metallic Madness and Titanic Monarch. And we can actually go through these together. And you'll get through them. All right, guys. Till next time. Bye-bye. And remember one more thing before you go. Mighty is overpowered. All right, bye guys. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Gay Plays. So, if you didn't check out last night's episode, basically we went through, um, what was it again? Oh yeah, Lava Reef Zone, and we also went through Oil Ocean. So now we're going on to Metallic Madness, a stage that well, it's madness, okay? So, yeah, here we are. So, this is probably gonna be so broken and stuff, so... Yeah, oh gosh! Really? Really, mate? Really? Alright, so we're gonna go roll down here. Alright, nice. Roll, 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 roll. Off the way up here. Alright, gonna hit this little thing, go over here. Alright, nice. Spin dash up here. Go down here. Go right there. Nice, okay? Jump up right here. Nice, got that. Okay, boom! Alright. I don't really want to switch, you know, switching. Oh gosh, maybe I should have switched. That probably wouldn't happen then. So yeah, this stage is probably the hardest out of the game. Well, no, Titanic, yeah, Titanic Monarch takes that spot. But I'd say this is the second hardest. Because this one, it's just, I don't know, it's... Eh, I don't know how to even explain it. It's, it's good, I guess, I don't know. Kind of torture, though, I'm not going to lie. Alright, so we're going to look out for those bees. Got a willy! Willy, I literally said look out for the bee guys and I got hit by a bee guy. Oh, okay, that's kind of broken. Not gonna lie. All right, spin dash a boom. All right, nice. Got those, got those rings going right there. Yeah, bounce right there. Get hit by that and then go back all the way back here. You actually get like a secret area down here. So, pew. All right, then boom. Then boom. And then there you go. All right, hit that thing right there. Take some invincibility right there. Go through this thing. Bounce down there. Oh, saw blades. Ooh, oof. Oof, don't mess with that. Okay, bit that thing right there. Yeah, boom. All right, roll down there. All right, nice. Yeah, boom. All right, there we go. All right, jump over there. All right, nice. All right, now we're going to spin dash. Okay, right there. There we go. Nice, 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 nice. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right, barely. Just barely. Okay, bounce right there. Get that little uh, checkpoint right there. And there. What, what? That's the end? Okay, never mind. This isn't that hard. Alright, so now we got a boss fight from Sonic 1, which is actually the final boss of that game. It's just a copy, but it's kind of broken with the spin dash. Yeah. I think they should have disabled the spin dash for this boss fight, because in the original, there was no spin dash. You had to do this in the original. You had to go like, ah, I don't want to get hit! And just like that, that's usually what would happen. But then again, back then, you had no rings. 
In this game, I think they intend for you to spin dash, but in that game, there was no spin dash. There was no way to, like, avoid it. So whenever, like, the ROM hack community and stuff got a hold of this, they added the spin dash. You could go, boom, and go through all of it, making it not even hard. It's, like, the easiest final boss out of any Sonic game. And honestly, it makes no sense to me, like, whatsoever. Like, in the second and the third one, they have, like, cool final bosses. This one's kind of questionable. Like, what? what is that, boy? Like, honestly. Oh, wait, what? He's got another phase? Oh, yeah, I forgot he had this phase where every, like, just all this random stuff happens. Forgot about that part. Alright, look up for those. Not that difficult, but still kind of questionable. Like, why is Eggman building some kind of weird stuff like that? Like, look at him. And how does that do damage to him? Like, is Sonic's quills that sharp to even hit through that? I mean, if it is, that's pretty powerful quills. I'm gonna have to give it to him. He's pretty, he's pretty tough guy. I'm not gonna, not gonna lie. Good. <laughs> All right, my E.T. got through Act 1. All right, I like my E.T. Look at him. Oh, wait, what? Did he just did he just wink at me? He's like, okay, I think he just winked at me. I'm seeing things, I don't know. Bruh, this is like, okay, not no jokes, though. I actually like this song a lot. So if you've actually played Sonic CD, you probably know the stage pretty well because it was the final one. And Sonic CD is probably one of my all-time favorite 2D Sonic games. Right after Mania 3, Knuckles, and all that stuff. But after you get through that, and oh, Tiny Mighty, look at that. Oh, he's just a cute little fella, isn't he? <laughs> Alright, go through that little loop-de-loop -loop right there. Bounce on that little thing right there. Alright, run through that jump. Bounce. Okay, this is actually really simple. Especially because I've actually, like, played this so many times now. I can actually go through this rather quick, actually. Without even Supersonic. Because Supersonic is cool and all, but, um... Let's just say his little theme gets a little repetitive. And it's like... Like, I wish they would just do, like, a, a speed up of the original music. That I, I'd actually like that way better than just that the Supersonic theme playing over and over. Alright, so now we're just going around here. Okay, nice. Okay, look out for those things. Okay, we got a little thing right there. We got to hit. Okay, bounce. There we go. Nice. Okay, got that. Alright, go through there. Get that little thing again. Yeah, there, this stage, I forgot, mainly focuses on being sh being a tiny little mighty and being shrinked down to the size of an ant. Oh, I thought there was a glitch right there where Sonic was going to be normal sized in this section. I was like, wait, what? So yeah, this is actually probably one of my favorite parts of the level is whenever you can be like a tiny little Sonic or a tiny little Mar Mighty, because actually, it's kind of cool, I'm not going to lie. And you know, the feature was in Sonic CD, I'm glad they kind of brought it back, because it's actually a cool feature. Oh no, I forgot about this part. This is like the most deadliest part, because you have to get there rather quick to get these things up here. Because they just drop down in a hurry, They're not, they don't have any mercy for anybody. You get down there and they get into your face, you're going to die, boy. I'm not even joking around. You get, you get down there right there, boom, you're dead. But yeah, if you get lucky, you can make it out alive. No hits whatsoever. And you know, this stage is... I actually like speedrunning this stage a lot, because it's really fun. I had a lot of practice with it, too. That's what makes it a lot of fun. Whoa! Okay, I'm not going to lie, that was actually really cool. Okay, spin dash up there. Whoa, jump. Jump up here. Hit that little item box with tails in it. There, we got everybody. All right, run, 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 jump. Okay, try to jump right there. Okay, got it. All right, switch him a real right there. Actually, I don't want to switch him a real. Okay, jump, switch back. Wait, I don't want to do this. Switch back. Okay, there we go. All right, go through that little room. Oh gosh! Oh wait, oh, what? Oh, okay, that was weird. We just like stuck on that thing. We're like, pew, 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 pew. all right. I don't actually remember this part. Like, I think we're getting towards the end because I don't know. I'm starting to recognize the level design here. All right. All right, that must shrink you. So. Times like this, I wish I had Mighty your tails or knuckles or somebody to climb up there. But then again, you don't even need them because you can just go this and go, Woo! Wait, what? Oh, yeah, this is the end. I forgot. Like, there was a totally secret ending you could do right there. Wait, actually, I, this I actually knew because I don't remember that from the other one. So now we have, like, a little thing here where Eggman's like a gumball machine. He shoots out stuff, so that's pretty cool. And if you look closely, you actually see some old versions of the stuff he's already created. So yeah, there's got the Sonic 2 boss fight, the very first one. You got another one where, um, I think, I want to say that was from, like, the one in Marble Garden where he shoots out that fire. You also got, like, this little Amy thing. So if you wonder where Amy was during the whole thing, well, there she was. She was a tiny little thing, like a robot, and she getting shot at Sonic. So, there you go, that's your answer. And there you go, that was a rather weird thing that Eggman invented. It was kind of strange, not gonna lie. <laughs> it was kind of weird, too. <laughs> 
And there you go, that's the end of Metallic Madness. Now we're going on to Titanic Monarch. That's right. Now, this stage right here, I'm going to tell you right now. It's a good stage. I'm not going to lie. It's a good stage. I love it so much. Wait, what? what's going on? I don't, I don't remember this part. It's like a transition? Must be. What was that? Oh! <gasps> But that's actually really cool. I actually like that a lot. Like you just see the robot flashing in the background. Like that. That is so cool. Alright guys. Now we're going on to Titanic Monarch. Which is probably a cool stage to be in right now. Kind of makes you think like you're like a little spy or something. Like going in to investigate what Eggman's crimes are. Because we all know he's guilty of something. Like I don't know what he's guilty of. But he's guilty of something. Trust me. I, I know what he's up to. But anyways, this stage is kind of cool, but it looks messed up as I don't know what that is. I want to say that's like a rainbow mixed in with the stage, which doesn't make it scary. It kind of makes it awkward and wacky. Like wacky workbench. <laughs> Anybody remember that stage? <laughs> yeah, good times. Anyways, this stage, you got to look out for like this little thing right there or get hit like that. And like takes it off. But if you do not do anything to get rid of that, you're going to die. No, no, no! Okay, good. <laughs> but yeah, you're gonna die. <laughs> so you gotta make sure that thing doesn't kill you. And always, it's always safe to collect rings around here because, you know, you gotta collect them rings. And pff, I thought I just saw Mighty just go out of that thing. He was like, pff, but no, he didn't. He's right there. Okay, go down here. Whoa, whoa, we're picking up some speed there. Oh, wait, sorry. I messed, up that. I messed that up bad. All right, but there's Wee! There we go! All right. Ye all right, hit that. Oh gosh, I didn't think that was spikes. I thought that was a uh, spring. Sorry. All right, go up here. Whoa, whoa, jump onto that one. All right, nice. Hop up here. Bounce. Okay, keep going. Woo, woo. All right, nice. Got a checkpoint right there. Gonna roll, 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 roll way over here. Whoa, look out for that shield. All right, doing pretty good right now. You know. Whoa, gosh. Okay. So apparently this is like uh, from uh, what's it called? Uh, wasn't this part from Scrap Brain Zone where you go up this little thing? I think I want to say it was actually, because in um, Scrap Brain Zone there's actually a similar section to that one right there, and uh, right here we don't really have a section that's similar because it's literally just a bunch of torture. And yeah, this stage is kind of torture because I'm not gonna lie, it's it's just torture, okay? All right, jump over there to Piggy. All right, dodge the pig. Oh, okay. Nope, 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 he's gonna let go. Oh, oh, you thought you could mess me up there, didn't you, Eggman? Wait, bounce. Get the same momentum. All right, nice. We are doing pretty good right now. Nothing, nothing's happened. It's made me, like, want to tear my hair out, so that's good. All right, we're just gonna go up here. Oh, forget that. Boom, let's go. Do, 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 do. No, don't take my shoulder away. Okay, thank goodness. Okay, gonna go over here, jump. All right, nice. Gonna go over here, nice, nice, nice. Jump right there. Oh, there we go. Oh, pff, rest in peace, mighty. Whoa. Okay, go up here. Whoa. Okay, okay. now that's not looking like a seizure. <laughs> Sorry. But look at that. There's just like a bunch of storm clouds up there. Okay, that kind of scary. Uh, I mean, this is not scary. It just looks like a rainbow. Like, looks like Green Hill Zone. Something's wrong with Green Hill Zone so hard right there. Like, I don't know what that is, but something's not wrong with it. Okay, wait, can you... Oh, wow, wow, you can't even do that. Okay, whatever. So, yeah, it's like kind of messed up, but kind of not messed up at the same time. Gosh! Okay, that that's... Try dodging that. Like, seriously, try dodging that. All right, going down there. Jump! All right, nice. Get that motor. Oh, gosh! Oh, ow. Okay, I thought I was going to hit some spikes right there. Woo! Oh, oh gosh okay okay there's, there's a lot of tricky stuff to avoid right here all right all right look out for there all right nice 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 all right boom bounce 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 okay look out for that th what is that um hello okay whatever all right gonna hop on these little things right here all right i'm doing pretty good I'm gonna look out for that okay spin dash way 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 up here go woo bounce okay nice we got that going all right bounce oh it's gonna hit that okay good now i don't know if you guys know this or not but titanic monarch 2 is like so much harder than this like this is just a easy walk in the park the next one is very complicated and when i mean complicated i mean complicated like oh my god oh 
I may or may not have forgotten about this boss fight. <laughs> um, but it's broken with Mighty, so... That's something to look forward to. <laughs> Bro, I remember the stage from uh, Death Egg. It was kind of hard to beat. But now we got this, and, you know, that's not hard to beat. This is kind of easy. Oh, gosh! Oh, wait, I forgot. Can you even get hit by those as Mighty? Oh, my gosh, you can't. The only time you can get hit by them is when they slam on the ground. Bruh, this is broken. <laughs> Look how broken that was. Bro, I remember when that boss... Oh, yeah, I forgot he got a second phase. What? The oh. How are you supposed to hit him? Oh, there we go. Oh, come on. Oh, we're so close. Okay, we got him. We're floating. Oh, wait, does he have to take eight hits or six? I think he might... Oh, yeah, he takes eight. Okay. Eggman wasn't fooling around when he built that thing. All right, nice. We got him good. All right, jump that over there. Okay, bounce. Nah, I didn't do anything. All right, whatever. My E.T. got through Act 1. Well, isn't that wonderful? <laughs> Great for him. Then he got Sonic over there, you know. It's doing normal. All right, anyways, go down there and whoop. Up. Going up. Going up. <laughs> Look at Mighty's. Did you really have to say that, bro? <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot about Mighty's waiting animation. I I've never seen that before. Was that what it was? Let's see. Oh, it was! He's just like, come on, you gonna play? I remember when Sonic used to do that thing in Sonic 3, like, he would like, to, he was like, do that thing where he like, put his foot down, he like, kind of like, just kind of sit there with his foot, he'd be like, you know, he'd just be stomping on the floor, like, pff, 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 pff. and then there's like the time where, like, in Sonic 3, he would like, point to the direction, like, you were face, so he'd be like, go, go that way, go! But now he just kind of like, he's kind of like, go, I want to go. <laughs> I think that's cool. They included one for Mighty and Ray. I mean, I, I couldn't imagine they wouldn't, but here we have the most trickiest level probably in the entire game because you have to really pay attention. There's a lot of, um, some, I don't know, it's kind of like a very, very, very complicated level and of dodging um, these little things right here. And um, you've also got to dodge those things. Also, there's a lot of portal traveling. And uh, there's a lot of areas you probably don't want to explore, but once you get to the all, all the areas, once you get to the end of all of them, you get the final boss, which is, um, I don't know what the final boss is. Actually, I do know what the final boss is. I just lied so hard. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I forgot what we were talking about. I, I, I think I was just thinking about, you know, how, like, the levels are like that. I was just like, okay, whatever. All right, going to jump up here. All right, nice, nice, nice. Got a nice steady momentum going on here. Oh, gosh. Okay, thanks. Thanks for the spring, boy. All right. No, I was right up there to a pig. I was up there to a pig, that green pig right there. He looks very familiar. I'm not going to lie. He kind of looks like Angry Birds pig. <laughs> He looks like an Angry Birds pig. Anyways, oh gosh! You hit a pig, a pig comes out. Logic. <laughs> Alright, bounce down there. Whoa, okay. Okay, now you gotta jump. Alright, nice. That thing just disappeared after a while. Alright. Roll back up, spin attack right there. Go around that loop de loop. Boom, there we go. Jump, kill that thing so it breaks the spring. I mean, not the spring, that little. I don't know what you wanna call that. Like a force field, I guess? And I go up there and kill the Angry Birds pig again. Okay, I'm gonna stop making that reference. Anyways, we're just gonna keep on going around the loop-de-loop. -loop. Spin dash! Whoa! Alright, go over there. Oh, no. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We're going down this way. What happened to Mighty right there? Did you just see him? He started rolling for no reason. I didn't even press a button. He just started rolling for no reason. You know what they say? Some say Mighty is still rolling on to this day. Alright, so I've actually completed that one right there, and it's actually blocked it off. So now we can either travel this way, or we can travel that way up there, or we can travel this way right here. So we're going to take this path down here. And, uh, yeah, after you get through all the paths, and it's the end. Oh, wait, what's this? Okay. I want to say I remember this one, but I don't. Oh, yeah, I forgot. It's literally mix and match. You might get it right, you might get it wrong. Oh, we got it right. Okay, good. Alright, bounce. Whoa! Okay. Well, what's this spin dash do right here? Boom, there we go. Block down. Oh, wait, we were right there to the end. Oh, wait, no, we weren't. That's not even the right exit. Oh, gosh. Okay, I'm going to blind myself with that. Okay, jump. What? Okay, we got... Okay, no, 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 no. I'm right there, I'm right there. Yes! All right, go down there. Really close. Okay, go, 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 go. There we go. We're doing it. We're going down here. Whee! There we go. All right, through there. 
slam down on that thing so it can get a little bit higher. Come on. Higher. Higher. A little bit more. There we go. Nice. Okay. Jump down there. Into this little car. Whoop. Oh. Okay. Oh. Ooh. I'm glad you can bl block stuff with Mighty's armadillo shell. Oh. Gosh. I didn't think Mighty could take spike damage. What? Okay. I think it's telling me I have to do this, because usually that thing would stop, but wait, I just saw Mighty's Lingy animation, right? Like he just, he's about to lose, he's going, oh, wait, does he get another one like Sonic did? No, he doesn't, okay, whatever. Alright, just keep on going, come on, Mighty, just run, oh, I kind of like that running animation, I just noticed that, that's actually really cool. What? Hello? Okay, thank goodness you can do that, because without that, we'd be still be on that section, okay, jump. Go for the loop-de-loop, -loop. okay, I think we're at the end, aren't we? Tell me this is the end. Oh, yes, it is the end. Okay. Then we go through this and boom. There we go. Okay, that's blocked off this path. Now the only path we've got to take. Well, no, there's two more p paths out there. There's so many paths. See, this is why this level takes forever. Because you have to go through all the different pathways from each different portal and go into the... What? Oh, okay. I get you. It's like that section in a spring yard zone where if you jump in the middle of it, you die. Well, rest in peace, Mighty, the most broken guy in a Sonic game ever. I mean, rest in peace, man. I'm, go I'm gonna miss you. <laughs> Alright, nope, don't land in the portal. Don't land, don't land there. That's not the good portal. That's, well, that's not the real portal is what I meant to say, but... Oh, gosh, don't mess that up. Okay, come on. Where's real portal? Where's real portal? Where's the portal master? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop. Jump. Oh, wait, no, no. Gosh, okay. We got this. Jump over here, come on. Where's Tails? Where's Tails when you need him? Like, Tails would be so useful in this section. I mean, I guess Knuckles would be, but you can literally just glide with it. Wait a second, that's the wrong exit, isn't it? I know it wasn't. That was the true exit, I guess. Oh, yes, that was the true exit. Okay, whatever. Alright, now we're going... I think this is the last portal. Alright, yep, this is the last portal, because I remember doing this one. Oh, go gosh, okay. Run, 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 run. Oh, nope. No, no, don't hit that. Don't hit that. Okay, there we go. All right. Okay, look out for that thing. It's just going to hit that thing. Okay, it's on Knuckles. I don't care if it's on Knuckles. Oh. Oh. No, no, no. Okay, good. I'm glad that thing explodes after time because I was about to say we're going to get hit. Okay. Nice. No, 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 don't jump. Oh, gosh. Why did I jump? Like, that was a trick. That was a dirty trick of Eggman. Okay. <gasps> how did I not get hit by that? Like, honestly, how did I not get hit by that? Like, what? Like, my mind cannot process that. Like, I don't know what I just witnessed or anything. I don't even know what's going on anymore. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah, I forgot that thing existed. Uh, my rings. My beautiful ring. Oh, gosh. This is the hardest part by far. Forget that. <laughs> this is the hardest part by far. Is when that thing goes up and down. You have to, like, dodge the thing before it, like, just crushes you. What? Okay, come on, Eggman. Now you're just being unfair. Because, like, that should not have counted. Like, give me my rings. Gosh, okay, wait. Hey, hey, you thought you could trick me, didn't you? Ha, <laughs> well, no. All right, go up here. Bounce. Okay, keep bouncing. Woo! Okay, I guess. Please no, please no. Please don't do this to me. Oh no, no, no! Oh, there we go. Okay, we're in. Oh, forget Knuckles though. He just... Oh, he's not even there anymore. Oh, there we go. We're at the end. Okay. I think there's like one more lap, one more portal. It's at the very top. Oh wait, no, it's in the middle. I'm sorry. It's at the middle. Okay, come on. Can't even reach it. There we go. Okay, guys, so I know how I was gonna tell you guys like I was gonna get the emeralds after the let's play and like go back and get the True ending well apparently if you do if you don't get the emeralds It just ends off after the boss fight and there you don't get like the special thing So I actually went back grinded on the special stage and guess what we got super person tells thing Yeah, I didn't say 
super character because we're Tails and Sonic. So, I don't think it's traditional to, like, have Tails save the day. So, you know, let's get Sonic. I'm just kidding. Alright, Tails is going to save the day. He'll feel like a big hero after this. But anyways, Jazz, just kidding. We're going to use Super Sonic. And yeah, with Super Sonic, this is kind of broken. Not going to lie. Because look. Wow. We're so good. Like... Probably one of the best. Okay, well, oh gosh. Okay, we got missiles coming in there. Okay, nice. A. All right, bounce, bounce, bounce. Okay, jump up there. Oh, look out for the gloves, though. Got to look out for them. Whoa. Okay. Oh, don't shoot me, bro. Don't shoot me. There we go. Got him. Okay. Yeah, the thing about this boss fight is you don't want to run out of rings because if you do, well, you messed up, and there's no coming back. So yeah, the important thing about this boss fight to know is you gotta hit Eggman. Gotta make sure you hit him. Come on. Hit that Eggman. You don't want to mess up, because if you do, well, it just doesn't feel right. Okay. Hey, we got him. We got him. Alright, nice. So yeah, I went back, grinded on the special stage. I would have recorded it, but it was honestly just really boring. Alright, so now we got the Phantom Ruby, which is going into a portal and Eggman's running away. Okay. Whatever. Whoa! What's going on here? What? Bruh. Alright! So that was the true ending for Sonic Mania. What? Okay. Bruh. Bro, look at that, you're too cool. <laughs> All right, so there you go. That was the true ending for Sonic Mania. All right. All right, so there you go, guys. That's the end of Sonic Mania Plus. You know, if you guys do want to keep seeing more Sonic games on my channel, make sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're new here. And uh, who knows, I might play Sonic Mania. Well, actually, no more Sonic Mania. I'm done with Sonic Mania. I was thinking about doing extras, but nah. Nothing really too special about that. But, you know, we still got Sonic Adventure, I'm going to do that. Sonic Adventure 2, I'm going to do that. Generations, I'm going to do that. All, pretty much all Sonic games. So, yeah, if you guys want to keep seeing more Sonic, then make sure to drop that like, subscribe. Like I said, until next time, peace. And remember, guys, Mighty, Sonic, Tails, Ray, and Knuckles. They cool dudes.